Oh, my back. I cracked it. Oh, fuck. That hurt. <laughs> he hurt. How the hell did I do this? I don't know. But hello, everybody. Welcome, welcome, one and all. We're playing Mass Effect Atromina. Now, I completed all the other Mass Effect games. So here we are playing this game. Um, I never really played it myself. Uh, I, I honestly don't know what to expect. I... Yeah, so I'm pretty hyped for this, sort of. I'm not that hyped, but we'll see how it goes. What? Here, let me put my headset on. I'm not even ready to do this shit yet, but you know, here I am. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Uh, on off. All right, I think we're good. Like, we should be okay. Well, hi everybody. Welcome to the stream. Hello, 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 Gubnuts. I don't know why <laughs> I said that, but huh? Somebody already sub little cog, little cog. Just, just subscribe. Holy shit! Well, thank you for subscribing, dude. Holy shit! Do a sue? What the hell is that? Post? By the way, what's up, cool? Oh, I was vomit. What's up, cool, Brian? Brian, Brian. <laughs> but yeah anyway so thank you guys or uh, thank you little i was expecting already a sub already jesus christ fuck all right here we go i fucked up all right here we go boys brightness uh uh fuck my sodas in a way what i don't like about my mic is that it's always blocking my view so i always have to move it and it's fucking annoying Now we'll move. <laughs> Do a shoe. A celebration? Jesus. I haven't heard about Ronaldo in fucking years. Does he still stream? Fuck, I don't remember if my head says No, my head says surround sounds. Alright, here we go, boys. Uh, quick start. What? What? Oh, okay. I just do a custom character because I want to make a new character because I never played this game before. Whoa! Now we have to wait for it to load. The journey is so far. The contents. You see a brick. Oh, fuck me, dude. I couldn't even read. That. I was trying to make it like into like, you know, interesting. All right, so a lot of people, I mentioned, I talked about, should I make a female writer, right? Hang on. Let me just, wait, let me make sure their resolution is actually accurate to, uh, Hey, I mean, let me make sure the resolution is it matched with my PC because sometimes it would not do that. So, yeah, I haven't heard about Renardo in fucking years, dude. Didn't he fell off or some shit? 
uh, let's see, video input. I, yeah, all right, it's good. Back, uh, audio. There we go, the video. All right, uh, gameplay. Um. I think this is kind of dumb. Why the fuck was there be an option to like have the helmet on or off in cutscenes? That's so fucking stu stupid. Dude. That's really dumb. I think this option is retarded. This has to be retarded. Like, why the fuck is this a setting? In Mass Effect 1 and 3, dude. Through 3. Well, actually, Mass Effect 3, actually. Yeah, your helmets do show in cutscenes, but it looks cool. But if you don't want to have your helmet shown in a cutscene, then don't wear a fucking helmet. I don't know why this is an option. This is so fucking retarded. What the hell? I'm already pissed off, and I I, I barely even start the game. I'm already mad. What the fuck is this shit? Rider's helmet off in gameplay and conversation. Off in conversations. As equipped. Why the fuck is this an option? It's so stupid. If you don't want your helmet to be shown in the cutscene, just don't wear a fucking helmet in the mission. So stupid. Anyway, it's just customized character. Alright, boys, here we go. Let's get this started. I was checking the resolution. Man, this game is already pissing me off. Now we're gonna wait for all the shaders to load in. Mass Effect 3 didn't have that. What the hell happened? Alright, so I did talk to you guys about, um, should I make a male or a female? And I was told by Grim, one of my moderators, said that uh, females look stupid, but I kind of like the face expression, in my opinion, because I think it'd be funny to see. But I want to actually uh, customize her appearance. I want to see what I can actually make her look like. Now, we are playing without mods, obviously. Um, right, there we go. Male. Damn, the male is 10 times taller than the female. Holy shit. What the fuck happened here? I was really deb debating to play as female writer so we could see her silly face expressions because it's super fucking hilarious to look at. Because I guess they overdid the face expressions in the game. Because I guess they were trying to show more emotions to the faces in the game. But like they, like for some reason with this character, this female writer, like her face expression would go beyond hilarious. <laughs> if you haven't seen Video Game Donkey video about uh, about Mass Effect Atromina, it's it's pretty funny. But like, um, who's training? Security. That sounds boring. You do, oh, I guess security is soldier, huh? Can we just play as a soldier? During your alliance military service, you focus on learning everything you could about weapons and tactics. Yeah, that's soldier. I do want to play as a different type of class. I I, I made Commander Shepard as a soldier, like a straight up soldier, like a straight up. You know, hero, like, like I don't need no biotics. Fuck that. I got muscle, baby. <laughs> so I kind of want to, like, uh, make a different version. A scrapper. I could be, I could be, I could be a scrapper bitch. Uh, operative. Uh, bi biotic. Let me down to try biotic powers in this game. Let's try it out. I've been always playing as a soldier throughout the game. So this is a new character. Let's make this character biotic. Um, I might just choose female just so, <laughs> so we could like, oh no, male shepherd. Well, bang, okay. It's kind of weird how you can't transfer your save to this game, but I guess it makes sense because it's like, it doesn't really matter because they, they, they remember who shepherd is and that's it. Damn, I kind of do miss playing Mass Effect though. I'm not going to lie. I might make another Let's Play of Mass Effect. 
series just play as the female shepherd we might just do like i'm gonna do like the complete opposite of everything what my male shepherd did obviously so make the game more interesting and different and um i might do that if they ever announce or show a mass effect 4 trailer or whatever if they actually like decide to drop the trailer or whatever i will actually do a, another let's play a mass effect but this time as a female shepherd so it'd be less boring no way you're playing mass effect 5 <laughs> we skipped to 4 and we went to 5 <laughs> Isn't it weird how Bioshock it was like, and Bioshock, Bioware was like, hey, let's skip four and just make a trauma. This is like years, year, many years after Shepard. No way you're playing uh, Mass Effect 5. Yes, I am, baby. I discussed my sort of appearance. Ooh. I'm just, oh God, that's. What's the difference between head three and head two? They look exactly the same, but one is black and the other one is white. Now, these faces are kind of atrocious. Writer looks weird. <laughs> Call my friend. I don't know who your friend is, man. Uh, we'll play as male Shepherd because, you know, why not? We'll play the default one. It doesn't matter. I don't really care, so. Import character data. Third man, start game. Is this like super easy mode? Make, like, we need a junior easy mode? Casual is probably easier. This was played. Hi yeah, guys, so welcome to Mass Effect Atromina. We're playing Mass Effect 5 for the first time. Um, I already, I already got pissed off by the settings because it's like, oh, do you want to keep your writer's helmet off or on during cutscenes and interaction? I'm like, what the fuck is this shit? We never had that in 3. So stupid. I'm already mad about that. I have to keep the helmet on because he looks cool with it. So I look more like a fucking soldier. I, oh yeah, we play, we're playing at Bunnock. Every great moment in our history began with a dream. I had a dream. Sorry. Each bold leap forward was achieved by those willing to do anything to attain it. Is that me? We are all of us leaving behind families, homes, the very birthplace of our species. Some for discovery, to see the unknown. Is this supposed to be like a hundred years after Mass Effect 3 or what? I don't really know how far the story goes in this game. But today, whatever our reasons, we take the first steps toward a new future for humanity. Today, we begin to make our dream a reality. I knew you were going to say that. Damn, look at that. Is that the Crucible? I look really cool. In the year 2185, humanity lives in a golden era of interstellar travel. Our discovery of ancient alien ruins on Mars. Uh, it's basically something like the first game. While many now join the few freedom of the challenges of exploration in the Milky Way, others look to even more than six stars uh, for hundreds and thousands of ventures embarking on the way of the. It begins! A trauma. Mass of it. Cool Brian says hi. Hi, cool Brian. How's it going, my man? I thought you left. <laughs> I thought you left. But uh, hi, man. 634 years later? Aw? 634 years? Jesus Christ. I'm pretty sure, uh, I'm pretty sure, uh, uh not Tali. Um, what's that blue bitch name? I totally forgot her name. But you know who I'm talking about. Aliara. I'm pretty sure she's still alive. Because they could live over a thousand years. Or beyond that, too. So, it's crazy. I look really cool. Trauma Galaxy. Destination Habitat 7 in Uslius Cluster. 
Lustar. Forever. We're playing as male rider, by the way. Because <laughs> he's taller and he actually looks like a, like a menace. I'm not saying female rider doesn't. I'm just saying, um, <laughs> you know. I, um, well, hello. There's me. Oh, he has some scrap. That's fine. We made it. Oh, why does he look pasty as shit? Deep breaths. You're gonna want to take it easy. I've been taking it easy for 600 years. Ryder, Scott, Recon Specialist, Pathfinder Mission Team. Pathfinder Team, eh? The ones finding us a home. Can you make it somewhere tropical? Nice, warm ocean, summer year-round? How about we get him a cup of coffee first? So I've been hibernating for 600 years? When well, he's... So, is he like some secret super weapon? Oh, no. Yeah, this was the trailer part. Doesn't look like you. Now we just went. We just stick with the de the default version of uh, Ryder. I didn't feel like customizing them. I just want to play the default version of Ryder, like I played default Shepard. So, because you know, I save time. I don't feel like customizing. I think Raider Ryder looks fine. He looks all right. This is a pasty white boy. <laughs> In back right in space. So easy, doesn't it? Uh. Uh, it's these easy, no fun. Uh. Even if it isn't, we'll be ready. I hope so. You know something? I hope so. Word came down. The Pathfinder wants you all mission ready within the hour. Look this way. Why the rush? He didn't say, but something's up. Okay, everything checks out. Just one more thing before I send you on your way. Let's test your Sam implant. My Sam, sperm? Are you what? monitoring? Sam, are you online? Yes. Of course he's ugly as shit. He's a man. What are you, gay? <laughs> what? Damn, Sniper Killer, you really want me to make a female? Dude, the females look like dog shit in this fucking game. Are you kidding me? I'm just going on. Cypher Kill is, dude, you've been spoiled because ever since I've been, ever since you saw my big titty goth girl, uh, cyberpunk character, V, like you expect all my characters to look like a hot, thick bitch, huh? <laughs> my implant. Uh, I just need a second to get my bearings. What's this about my implant? A routine check. After being in stasis, we want to make sure the connection is still live. As the team's mission computer. Yeah, I was already hating on my character. This is the default character, by the way. This isn't my customized character at all. This is the default. Sam sees what you see. I know you're into women. We won't know for sure but this is war, baby. We need a man figure. We don't need a pussy figure, you know what I mean? I'm kidding, by the way. But yeah, I, I'm just used to playing as a man in uh, Mass Effect. It's always feel, it, To me, it's weird to play as a female in Mass Effect for some reason. But, um... If they ever announce Mass Effect 4 at the trailer, all that shit, I will redo all the Mass Effect Let's Plays. Definitely a draw, i we'll play as a female. We'll do the female version of that. But we're playing the male version of the game, alright? I'm ready to get to it. Readings confirmed. So, everyone calm your dicks. Never Sniper killer, put system. your dick in your pants. We're all having fun here, right? Caffeine I just don't feel like customizing that character right now. You're all done. Let's get you on your way. Though you may want to hang around while we revive your sister, it always helps to see a familiar face. Hit my woman all the time. I don't even have a woman. Dude, I'm single, brother. I don't know what women you're hitting. What the fuck? Am I going to a butthole? Oh yeah, zero gravity. You got saved by plot armor. <laughs> Plot armor. Sniper killer says I'm lesbian. Aren't you a dude though? Oh, uh, what did I do? I yeah, died. Okay. For some reason, the game let me look around, but this is Cora. I'm at the cryo bed. all right. Brace for a reset. All right, we got a lesbian in this team, so let's go. Everyone I okay? Die. I think so. What happened? Sniper Killer, you're a woman? Sensors Since when? But it's good to see your I thought you were a guy the entire time. Since we spoke. This is the Pathfinder. Mission teams continue preparations. Cora, Riders, report to the bridge. 
Yo. You heard him. Let's get. Uh, we have a problem over here. I mean, do you want me to play as female uh writer instead? Never was a guy. Wait, you're a female? No way! What, dude? Are you blowing? Bro, April first is over. Are you fucking kidding me? You're a female? The entire time, I thought you were a, a male. Huh? <laughs> Yo, the more you know. <laughs> the more you know. I don't know. Have to check it out. I didn't know I have a lesbian in my in my stream. Well, well, I'm, I'm, <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> Yo, I'm learning more about my chat every day. <laughs> Who's my sister? Do we have more options to do it now? Check on your wait. I have a sister. Who's my sister? Are you my sister? Are you my sister? Are you my sister? Are you my sister? Who's my sister? You never asked me. True, that is very true. Wait until you tell Grim. Wait until I tell Grim that you're a girl, and then he'd be like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> I bet you Grim thought you, you were a guy. <laughs> Wait, so, okay, so the captain is this guy over here, right? But the the side mission is... Check on your sister. Is my sister the dyke? The dyke with the, with the hair? Damn it! I didn't check on my sister! Can I check on her now? Who the fuck is my sister? Eh, whatever. Fuck her. Fuck him. Fuck him. Oh, shit. Uh oh. The door's power is malfunctioning. L all? Ryder can find it. He has a scanner. Quick, Ryder, use it to locate the fault. On it. I'll try to get readings on the second conduit. I'll try oh, to run a It's like a pit boy. I'll override the station. Got it. Ryder. There's no indicator. Relay 2C, shows damage from a temperature spike. Oh yeah, we're playing as bio, 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 what is it, bio, bionetic or whatever, the, the ability that Jack had. You know, mix things up a bit. I didn't know the other bitch was my sister, so. Oh well. There, it's reset! Please stand by while the conduit finishes sighting. So the uh, conduit finished it. Masturbation. Hello everybody, yeah, we're here we are. I never played this game, so I do apologize if I uh, don't know what the fuck I do sometimes. Because, you know, first time for everything, I guess. This game looks kind of shitty, I'm not gonna lie. I think Mass Effect 3 looks better than this. I'm gonna be real, this game kind of looks mushy as shit. Like, it doesn't look that impressive, in my opinion. It looks like it was made, like... Differently. Is that? I think that's supposed to be my sister. Yeah, she's fine. She looks like she's a tough gal. She can handle this. When am I my sister's keeper? I mean, she signed up for being a military person. I'm pretty sure she can handle this. Helm control, report. We're drifting. Flight controls aren't responding. Your mom's not responding. First priority is stopping these outages. Mainline power's been knocked out. We're on reserves, Captain. They won't last. What's our position? I'm hey. Here. We lost hey, to Sam, we need eyes out there. We're attempting to adjust sensor array. Alec, please. You may be Pathfinder, but this is my ship. Captain, the protocol's clear. In the absence of communication with the Nexus or the other arcs, we proceed to our appointed golden world. Solid ground. If it's even out there. Nobody said anything about running into an energy cloud, and that's just a wild guess what we hit. What the hell is that? Reapers? Alec, I need to assess the damage. Stop the bleeding. We've got 20,000 people asleep on this ship. Let's give them a chance to wake up. Can wake up! I prefer solid ground. Uh, it's our call. She is the captain. I think oh, she's the, the captain? captain? Damn, I'm a sexist asshole. This isn't about having the final word. Thought that guy was the captain. <laughs> he looks like and sound like a captain. 
Here's the voice of a captain. My God. Is it Earth? Is that our golden world? The Earth? That's Habitat 7. New Earth, if we're lucky. Are we looking for a new Earth? All of our long range scans told us it was in the green zone. Perfect for human settlement. It doesn't even look the same. We don't know how bad it is yet. Still seems like it's our best shot. Maybe. There's just a lot on the line. Sam? The energy from the phenomenon is dumping our senses. Oh, this conditions Fuck are Sam. Awesome. Damn, we we'll never replace a thick robot AI bitch that we all love and want to fuck. Runs out, stays out. We need to know if that's safe harbor. And if it's not. As Pathfinder, it'll be my job to find an alternative. It's what we trained for. But if this goes well, we are already home. All right, just make it quick. Harper, the rest of the team should be awake by now. Have them spin up two shuttles. Planet Fallen 30. Yes, sir. A stubborn one, isn't he? I went not Your guess is as good as mine. We may be related, but I still haven't figured him out. Wait, I'm related to her? Or him? Huh? I'm confused who I'm related to in this game. We're blind out here. I'm confused who's related to my character. I'm just used to Shepard being alone, not having any relatives. I don't know what backstory I gave Ryder, but I think we went to the default version of him. My sister's gonna hate that she missed this. Are all the riders adrenaline junkies? I guess it's in her blood. She beat me into the world by one minute. Couldn't wait to get started. Well, don't worry. I'm sure Sarah will pull through. There when she does, Sarah. she's gonna want stories. So, let's get out there and find her son. Huh? Right, you'll want to get your helmet. And maybe stop at the good luck rock before we go. The what? Huh? It's an old superstition of your dad's. What, you fucked my dad? Yo, I think she fucked my dad in this game. Yeah, so there was an option to put your helmet or have the helmet on and off in the beginning of the game, which I thought was stupid. Good luck, Rock, huh? Your dad was mountain climbing back on Earth. It caught him from falling. The way things are going today, we'll need any luck we can get. Yeah. Alice Ryder. Air Rider. I like Looks like Dad's already suited up. Damn, the whole family's. All right. Hang in there, Sarah. Let me guess. I'm the big brother. Big brother. Got it. That should do it. The Pathfinder is now requiring sidearms. I've opened the armaments locker. We I have infinite control. sprint. A precaution. Please arm yourself, Rider. We I'm I'm doing laps around. Yeah. What the fuck does this happen? Oh, okay. G is to scan things. Right, let's pick up my gear. Hope I don't need this. What do you mean? You hope you don't need this? You're a fucking. You're a space marine. What do you mean? I hope I don't need this, bro. Huh? What you what you thought this was? Being not a space farmer? And these guys. Let's see already. I don't like him. Ryder? Hey, Fisher, how's it going? I heard a rumor from the bridge that your dad and the captain aren't seeing eye to eye on this. Oh, daddy issues? She wasn't thrilled with the idea of the expedition, but my dad won her over. I heard you weren't a big fan of it either. It's her ship, her call. You got guts going Wait, so those two are his parents? The way I see it, that's wild. Team answers to the Pathfinder. That's crazy. Besides, your dad's the N7 here. He's got the best aim. I go wherever he goes. That's crazy. I didn't know that. So. Ooh, water cooler. Drink water, boys. No bathroom breaks in this trip. <laughs> so just another boring day at the office, huh?
If it was, this wouldn't be any fun. I can't wait to find out what's down there. I know what you mean. I always wondered what it was like when explorers crossed the ocean. Nothing but stars and dead reckoning to guide them. And a map that said, here be dragons. Well, if they made it, we can too. And maybe see a dragon along the way. Oh. Never know. Let's keep an eye out. And our distance. <laughs> On that note, time to get to the shuttle. I feel like he, she's the one who could like pin you against the wall and fuck you in the ass. She'd be the man in bed. Anyways, let's so this is like a whole family thing. Of, of Doctor Carlyle, with everything going on, I think the Ark needs you more than we do. Pathfinder wants a medic on hand, and if that is home down there, I'm happy to knock on the door. If it's what we hope it is, it'll be one for the history books. You got a quote ready? One small step. I'm pretty sure your dad will handle that honor. All right, team. I have a feeling that dad is going to die. Five. Sir, we broke out the weapons as requested. Anything we should know about? Seem prudent given the situation. We'll be short-handed with Sarah out. He does look kind of like his dad. I heard what happened. Your sister's strong. She'll make it. We bet on whose boots would hit the ground first. This isn't how I wanted to win. <laughs> well, knowing Sarah, she'll want to go double or nothing on who climbs the tallest mountain. Wow, he, he looks down. exactly like his father. And Holy shit. Sharp. I understand. That's crazy. Your mom would have been proud. Of both of you. But the ship leader was my mom. Okay, team, listen up. I chose each of you for the Pathfinder team, not just because you're talented and passionate, but because you're dreamers, like me. Huh? We dream of exploring the unknown, oh. finding the edge of the map, and then discovering what lies beyond. When people look back on this, and they will, they'll remember we didn't give up, that we kept dreaming. That our first few faltering steps in Andromeda were the beginning of everything. Ah, he said the name! He said it! We only get one chance to be first. So, let's go make history. I think they're too shiny. I get it, they try to make them look oily, but I think they're a little too shiny, in my opinion. Is that my bro? Like my homie? Right, let's go, baby. Let's go save my sis. Big brother. Well, bang, okay? Wow. Will you look at that? Huh? Whatever it is, it stopped the Hyperion in its tracks. It appears to be an unstable mass of dark energy. If you say so. Is it Geth? Could be Geth. Gravity anomalies detected. We're clear. Ryder, we didn't have a chance to meet back in the Milky Way. Name's Liam Costa. Security and response missions. Good to meet you, Liam. Hard to believe we're finally doing this. Sure beats reading the brochures. Beginning our deceleration. Planet's dead ahead. You guys were rookies. Ah, right, this looks kind of... Hang on. Initiating atmospheric entry. Here we go. Copy that. Doesn't look like a golden world from here. Ionization levels are rising. Stay on course to the landing zone. Oxygen levels are below minimum human requirements. Is this the right planet? We had this all worked out. Keep it tight, Shuttle 2. Uh, the mountains are floating. Something's very fishy here. Something about. 
I think the dad's gonna die. When with the N7 armor. And then somehow we could become the N7 after him. Because of the cover, I think. That's what my guess was. Because we're wearing the N7 armor in the game, in the, in the covers. Oh shit. Oh, I like these guys. Oh shit. No, my friend. Oh shit. Acceleration increasing. Oh shit. No kidding. Your junction is malfunctioning. Get it working. Velocity. I can't really do anything. I can just look around. Well, we died. Thank you guys for watching. Ow. 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 Oh, it's breaking apart. Damn! That's some high tech right there, dude, to fix the helmet. Class like that, that's, that's the future we need. Ooh. Looks cool. Looks like a fucking unknown world. Well, technically, it is, but. This is Ryder. Come in. Hyperion. Sam, anyone there? Save your breath, Ryder. Sam's offline. Comlink's trashed. <coughs> I'm surprised we are too. Did the others make it? I don't know. It was all a blur. Shuttle split in two. This is like some nightmare. Yeah. No way this is home. I mean, it has clouds, like Earth. Looks like we're gonna find some high ground. See if anyone else is alive. Come on. All right, now we're actually gonna play the game. Now I'm gonna check the game real quick. Oops, the game a second. I wanna make sure everything is okay. See if anyone else is alive. Come on. All right, audio of the game is fine. It's actually pretty decent. Wow, yeah, like. Ryder. There we go. Jeez. How's your survival training? Alright, um, hang on, let me fix this real quick. Uh game settings gameplay. Oh, uh video. Alright, there we go. There we go. I've seen my share of troubles. Nothing crazy. Oh shit, I have a boost. That's Whoa. sick. Crazy just found us. Those ropes out there are floating. Terra incognita. Some of these plants look like tentacles. It's the There's our com device. Damaged in the crash. No good to us now. Oh, and safety tip. Don't breathe the air. Found that out the hard way. Got it. You think that energy cloud we saw could cause all this? Sam said it's dark energy, but that's in space. Yeah, hell of a cloud. A cloud that makes it... Uh, what the hell is this? Come on, we gotta get through it. This is crazy! Welcome to Habitat 7! Keep moving! Run! Ah! I ain't gotta look. I ain't gotta save his ass. Look safer <laughs> under there! Is this for real? You what the pussy? What's going on with this place? I don't know. It's Avatar World. Look, 
Yo, it is Avatar. This guy. Oh, wow. Here be dragons. Coral what he was calling me? It was the spammers. Ow. Hang on. Uh, was it G again? All right. No rip. Run! Get up that cliff. We find high ground. Oh wait. Come on. Not sure we want to be the tallest thing around here. Can I get that? Oh, we do have a blade. Nice. But we don't have to hold it. It just stabs himself. I think it's, I think it's just an ammo crate if we run out of ammo. I think I can see a pop up. We use the jump jets if we have to. Into the breach. I've been using the jump the jet for a while. Give it a minute. We can probably do both. Hey, Bader. How'd my dad find you? Hey, Bader. Hey, Bader. Make sure you guys hit that like button on the stream, bubble. Yeah? Tell you over a beer sometime. This is gonna be close. What? Oh, okay. There we go. I'm gonna say there's no way in hell. We're getting there. Oh, cool. We can actually climb up. That's good. I think I see the top. There we go. Am I making some room? <laughs> Thanks. What the hell is that? Damn. That doesn't look good. It's not a hotel, that's for sure. Nothing around here makes any sense. New galaxy, new ways to die. Just not today. Right up. It's Fisher. Mm. Wait. Look. Oh, a new alien species that we've never seen before. Follow protocol. Take it easy. We only get one shot at hello with these guys. Yeah, and if it should get shot in the head if we're wrong. Nice and easy. We only go hard if we have to. Don't think they spotted us yet. No, I got shot. He picked us. We can't understand you. We're not here to fight. That man's with us. You got shot. Doesn't sound friendly. What's the other guy doing? Shit! This just got real! Oh! Okay, so we take over by ourselves. An unknown species that we don't know okay. about. Okay. It's over. Bishop, you okay? I'll live. I thought I was a goner. Sorry, Ryder. I know you wanted to get peace of chance and all. They weren't going to back down. What did we do? Reload and try and put it behind us. We still don't even know what they wanted. Nothing good the way they were armed. Who says we even understand? Or they'd understand us? It's a new galaxy. I guess it's too much to expect they'll play by Milky Way rules. Or any rules by the look of them. But what did we do to them? Only thing I know for sure, their guns hit just as hard as ours. Where are the others? Gone. Kirkland and Greer went looking for help. Come on. Ah, my leg! My leg! Can you move? He said his leg hurts, bro. Did you guys push ahead and look for the others? You sure? Yeah. Just find us a ride out of here. And take a few more of them out while you're at it. Whoa. Take a look at these bodies. What are these things? Oh, I'm on fire. Well, I don't have Sam here, but I can try to make sense of it. They're DNA based, and their armor reads as some kind of bone. But 
the genetics are all over the map. Ah, I guess life took a different turn here, huh? I hope the other team's okay. Ooh, a pistol. We'll find them, but we might want to scout around first. Uh, let's take all of them. You're the recon specialist. Point the way. <laughs> right. Looks like you knew how to handle a gun back there. Spent time with an Alliance peacekeeping force. <laughs> uh, make sure you guys hit the like button, by the way. Okay, the other member is a Pathfinder. Uh, you got it, buddy boy. He seems dead. No vital signs. Just shot him in cold blood. He was trying to surrender. Why kill him? Would we treat them any different if they showed up on Earth, armed to the teeth? Uh, maybe not. Peace isn't going to be an option here. Man down. We'll come back for his body once we find the others. Oh Part shit! One. I could use my bio. Still, bio take power. a look at this architecture. This is really something. Oh, that's not what I meant to push. Left 600 years ago, right? Yeah, our long range scans wouldn't have shown this. These structures, that tower, maybe none of it was here when we left the Milky Way. Okay. Okay, now this is weird. Even with these readings, I have no idea what it does. <laughs> Just imagine the mind that invented it. If that's even possible, evolution separated from ours by two million light years. Spooky when you put it that way. What is this? Press L control to interact. Oh no, it just told me to climb up. Never mind. I thought it, was, it told me I can activate it somehow. I was like, really? I can activate it? <laughs> I fucked up. <laughs> the boost is pretty cool on the on the armor. from one of our shuttles. Good. The atmospheric sensor is still working. Let me guess. It says don't breathe the air? Yeah. Hear that? They're on to us. Here we go. Fuck you, bitch. Oh, we do have another weapon. Nice. That we only have a pistol. Fuck you, bitch! Nice. 
Yeah. We're clear. First species we meet is out for blood. Not if we don't give it to them. I gotta stand, do I gotta scan this? Hey look, flares going up over there. Could be our people. I'll mark the nap point. <laughs> the hell's that? Man, watch out! What is this thing? Okay, it's dead. Whatever. It's organic. No sign of technology. Wow, so the cloaking is biological? Yeah. Weird. <laughs> That's cool. So it was just born to out. It's the other half of our shuttle. What a mess. I can't believe we survived this. We're not off the planet yet. Shit, we're holding our perimeter. It's an ambush. Oh, hell, they got the jump on us. <laughs> Can't put it go one of those animals. Watch for cloaking. Watch for them. They force this. Trying to surround us. Keep an eye on your six o'clock. And our two o'clock. And our eight. Thou are all of our box. There. We got them all. <laughs> oh, you pretty good at this, Ryder. I fought off the occasional raider or two in my day. I used to guard a Mass Effect relay. Oh shit. Wish we'd had one for the Orcs. Maybe we should see if there's anything else useful here. He used to protect the Mass Effect relays. Damn, that's crazy. Some sort of structure up that hill. This place is taking a beating from the storms, along with everything else on this planet. <laughs> oh god, excuse me. Oh god. Are we being shot at? No, we're not. Well, let's hope no one's home. Doesn't look like a home at all. All the chest trips are in this game. Yeah, no one's living here. So what's it for? Doesn't look like the other structures we've seen. Different design. Must be a way to get some lights on. They're like a kind of like a little cave that we can get, like some armor and shit. And you see, like Master Chief busted door. <laughs> He's like. That we must beat the bat. Huh. What's all this about? Huh. Who knows? Let's call it a weird alien machine. We sure could use Sam right about now. You guessed it. Another weird alien machine. Huh. Figures. Only one way to find out. You mean turn it on? What are you doing, Ryder? Oh shit. What? That can't be good. Oh. So the weird alien machine is a generator. Yeah, sure. Why wouldn't it be? Maybe it did something. I'll probably open that door over there. <laughs> hey, that door open. 
This mobility is nutty. Some kind of research lab? Maybe. Then it got hit by a tornado. Right, let's see what we do. Weird. You hear that? Looks like they were trying to tunnel in. Don't think it turned out so well. Some serious energy on the other side of that door. Maybe it's closed for a reason? These guys were poking around where they shouldn't have. His wounds look like they're from an energy blast. Uh, watch it! Watch. What is it? This? There. So now kill... Keep Learn hitting the wrong button. Too? Get back home would love this place. Ah, yeah. Doesn't say much, other than it's not organic. And it's about the same age as that artifact. You suppose it was guarding it? Could be. Well, either way, I don't think we can open this door. Nothing else we can do here. Any theories, recall specialist? There's some kind of technology on this planet. Older. Underground. Something these aliens are interested in. Weather's still crappy. Run! Heads up! Go to the other flare area. Down the right. You hear that? Yeah, radio static. But like a pattern. Whatever's causing that, it's a lot closer. Can I scan it? Nope. That okay. static's getting louder. What's down here? Check that out. Now this looks more like the golden world my dad was expecting. Then the long range scans were right. This could have been home 600 years ago. And then, who knows? That if it's anything like plants back in the Milky Way, there are signs of cellular mutation. It's lasted this long. Guess that makes it the alpha tree, huh? Yeah, but what happened to all its friends outside? Fine. Probably the only living left. Uh, the only living life around here. It's over here. We're really gonna keep doing this, huh? I wanna know what's down here. Right. Recon specialist. Oh! That sound coming from below? Alien. 
Scythian gods of the underworld? Huh, <laughs> don't say that. I think it's machinery. You can feel the vibration. Oh, the scale of this. Who built it? Alien gods. Alien god. The writer is over 600. So all of these guys are over 600. Hope the other shells are incredible. Ryder, move those aliens ahead. They see us! Here we go! No much to Can I sh Yeah, I can sh I think we're going to the right. someone would notice you okay yeah where are the others they killed kirkland but fisher's alive back at the crash site he's got a broken leg needs help i'll check around for supplies then head back stay put when you get there we'll look for my dad's shuttle good luck can't wait to get off this rock So we saved that guy. That's cool. Good way to break your neck. Anyone there? Cora, we read you. You're alive. Shuttle repairs are underway, but we're surrounded. They're not friendly. On our way. That point marked. Let's get in there. Eat my force, bitch. They're trying to pin us down. Doing a good job of it, too. Try to light them up. I'm on what do you think I'm fucking doing, weed? Yo, it has auto aim. That's crazy. Pick your target. Fuck you, low. bitch. Fucking you should aim, dumb bitch. I'm doing all the work. No, I hope you die in the game. Fuck you, I, I don't even like her anymore. Well that sells that. She, I hope she dies Calvary in the, to the rescue. Nice to see you guys. You too, Harry. How is everyone? It. Still in one piece. You got here just in time. Where's my dad? Daddy? He's scouting ahead while we fix the shuttle. Ryder, there's weapons and ammo at the shuttle. Stock up. Did these things try talking to you at all? Barely a word. Then started shooting. What about you? We didn't stop for a chat. Ah, oh, hell! Enemy ship on the way! Get 
to cover! Go! Go! I didn't... Alright. Here they come! They got fools to try and airdrop. Got you. Oh, he has green blood. That's cool. Oh, it's a heavy boy. Man, these guys don't have to fight. Bitch. Fucking bitch. Yeah. Liam, enough. Right. It's just these arsehole kill Kirkland. I hear you, but this isn't the time to lose our cool. Now I feel better. What about the others? Fisher's wounded, but sitting tight. Greer's with him. Though our shuttle's in pieces. Died. She's been hit! My mama? Take cover! Take cover! Oh shit. Oh shit, that's a bite. I didn't know you were biotic. Don't worry, it's not contagious. Before they attacked, I... They managed to fix our comms. You're a lifesaver. Now just take it easy. I'm also a biot biotic. Q receiving established. Affirmative, Scott. The path Not the Lego's biotic, but... <laughs> Good to see you in one piece. What's our... Daddy! Liam daddy! It's my daddy! The good news is our shuttle's been repaired. We can get back to the Ark. Not with these storms. It's too risky to fly. Our wounded can't wait much longer. Do you have something in mind? If the storm is the problem, then let's solve the problem. Oh shit. I like We're that talking attitude. talking about weather. And I have an idea about that. Rendezvous with my coordinates will... Damn, they spotted me. Sir? Sir! Can you two manage alone? I can keep her stable. For a while. Let's move. Alright. Sam. Was so far so good? I'm actually enjoying the game. Position. It's pretty Marking fun so far. On your map. Doesn't look uh. Let's make this quick. We have to get there before the storm hits. No detour. What was my dad scouting for? He was trying to get readings on that tower. Well, the nap would to near it. Exercise caution. The storm front is already gaining intensity. Nice to have you back, Sam. How about some good news next time? I see my dad. Daddy. Ow. Oh, okay, bye bye. Sam's right. We don't have much time. Look, the rot. Oh, escape is to level up? That's weird. Alright, so core and Liam. Um uh, it's a level up rifle. Um, we don't have a sniper or a shotgun, so. There we go. Pistols and uh, assault rifles confirmed. If we hunt 
that wall. They might keep us safe. The body's here. Lightning didn't do this. Incendiary rounds. My dad's been busy. He was an N7. They don't mess around. I mean, look at Commander Shepard. He doesn't fuck around. I mean, he does fuck around. Somebody was pretty clever with these rods. Only way to survive here. Two. If you count shooting on sight. Helicopter, helicopter. Close. The half point shows my dad's up there. That helicopter was pretty close. Did daddy die? Sir. Daddy. Stay low. Oh. <sighs> we need to build a wall to keep the humans out. <laughs> They look kind of cool, though. Not gonna lie. Who are these guys? Visitors, just like us. I don't think they're native to the planet. They're not. We found an abandoned lab. Like they've been studying the place. Good work. You actually did some scouting. Wouldn't be much of a recon specialist if I didn't. Well, you're off to a good start. <laughs> Baptism by fire. Sir, you said you had an idea about the weather? It's the dark energy cloud the Hyperion hit. It's affecting the whole planet. Interfering with that. The tower is caught in a feedback loop with the cloud. Together they're disrupting the entire climate with undirected energy. It would explain a game like a giant galaxy butthole. From, storm, from that tower. It's a good bet. And I think if we can get in there and shut the tower down, the lightning goes away. And the shuttle can get us out of here. In theory. We just have to get past them. Let's do it! It's a hell of a gamble. But we won't well, 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 we meet again. Good. No illusions about this. I, um, Hadzai or Hazai? Oh my god, I fucking your so name wrong. I'm sorry. But we're Hello there, Galvin. I'm calling you Galvin because it's easier to remember. I'm sorry. Oh, it's them. Problem is, we're on. Oh, hi, Galvin. How's it going, man? I've been working on that. We just need to change the math. <laughs> we're playing a traveler for the first time. I kind of enjoying it, but you know, the settings pissed me off because of the helmet. Like, oh, you could choose to take off the helmet during the cutscenes. I'm like, why? That was never in Mass Effect 3, and that was never a problem. I thought it was stupid. How cool they look. They look like they'll be in uh, Destiny 2. Hasiel. 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 I say Hasi'i. <laughs> I was close. I'm sorry. <laughs> but alright. Hasi'i. Hasiel. 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 Alright. But yeah, welcome to Mass Effect. We're, uh, uh, we're, we're playing at the uh, bio. Bio, bi what is it? Bionic? Bionic? Not the Bionic, uh, the, the, uh, the, uh, the Legos guys, but the, uh, the actual ability of the game, of course. You know, change things up a bit, you know. Because, you know, we play as a soldier, as a pepper, so I want to try Bionic. Because Bionic always seems like a very go-to best, um, uh, ability to have, because it's super good in every, uh, Mass Effect game. It's like it's like basically like having uh, being like a Jedi but using only guns instead of lightsabers. It's basically what it is. <laughs> Good. I'm just studying for my math exam right now. Damn, dude. I hope you're. I hope you do well in your math exam. I hope you get an A plus. I'm playing this game for the first time. I think I bought this game for like eight dollars or two dollars. No, no, I bought this game for nine dollars because it was on sale on Amazon. On, uh, Amazon. On a uh, on, on fuck on uh, Streamlabs. Not Streamlabs, uh, Steam. God damn it. <laughs> Sam, biotic amp interface. Yeah, welcome to Mass Effect 5, guys. Have to keep an eye on our flank. It's kind of funny how to make him Mass Effect 4, but oh, Trauma is like legit. They just skipped the number and they're like, yeah, let's go to a Trauma. I thought a Trauma was 4. And then they're like, oh, we're making 4. I'm like, so a Trauma is 5? Yeah. They're like, huh? 
Unless it's like a different bur or like a different storytelling. They could they could keep it separate like how how Call of Duty does it with a Black Ops and and uh and and uh what is it Modern War was it Mon yeah Modern Warfare and Black Ops you know how like they have like separate stories I'm pretty sure they might doing that for Mass Effect like one story is more focused on like um Darren Shepard and then one focus on Ryder I mean that's fine to me that's like some Disney shit Disney Plus shit if you think about it. Get the moon. Ready? Let's get inside there. Oh yeah, daddy. Daddy. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome, uh, Hasil. Of course, man. Stay in school. Almost right, me. What are you stuttering? St stuttering. What are you studying? Studying. Or anyways, what are you try to be after college or high school or whatever? I'm sorry, I can't even speak words. I can't even speak English because English is awful to speak. Even though it's my first fucking human language on earth, on, I still have issues about it. Come on, into the building! Damn, look at him! Fucking super saying up this bitch. Sam, give me engineer profile. Did I just broke the window? <laughs> Yeah, look at him super armor, dude. That's crazy. Sir, where are you getting these profiles? Will help from Sam. What does that mean? Just focus on the fight. Is he running in? Dude, Jesus Christ, this guy really believes he's Master Chief. We'll lose our chance if we or or uh or uh or Shepard. No one could be Shepard. Shepard was like the, the goat. Yes, I believe we're all rookies, though. Looks like a Keep off my back. Sort of like rookies. Honestly, recently, um, un uncleared. <laughs> LOL. Just trying to pass my classes, but maybe optic science, aka lasers. <laughs> what now? Lasers. Lasers. If you guys get that lasers from Austin Powers Golden Member. No? Okay. Um that's cool. You could invent lasers. So you dude, you could create the Mass Effect world into a reality? That's wild. I mean that's really cool though. That sounds badass, dude. All your dreams! You can do it, my friend. You can do it. Even though if you don't feel like you can do it, you fucking can do it. The only person who can stop you is you, brother. Remember that. The only person who can stop you is you. So Chase your dreams, my friend. Chase your dreams. Become what you want. Like I'm chasing my dreams right now. I'm trying to be a a a, a, a priority uh, YouTuber, and so far it's working. I'm having a lot of fun. Oh wait, I supposed to go over here. <laughs> Fuck right Oh, I gotta make um. I gotta give orders. Right. Watch it! I think I see movement! In the door or? Oh shit. We held them off at the shuttle, we can do it again! A lot of people still counting on us! Oh, Let's okay. Get warmed up. LOF, possibly, thank you. Possibility, thank you. I'm doing my best. Keep them off your <laughs> hey man, that's it's better than nothing. Better than nothing. Not a lot of people can say they try their best. Shut up, bitch. What are you, my ma? Both both Fuck you! Anyway. I don't know, but they sure want it back. <laughs> I think I really pissed that one. Well, 50% decrypted. It's an unusually complicated syntax. I can Help see the very best for you, man. Search. Deli, I gotta go to study. Haha, <laughs> have a good day. Well, thank you, man. I do appreciate it, man. Study hard, my friend. Study hard. Not too hard, but like, study hard enough. Oh, shit! Stab the dog with the knife. Dude, that did a lot of damage. Holy shit. Sir, any progress? Decryption is 75% complete. We've almost got it. Could be regrouping for another push. 
push. Stay sharp. No, they're not. Oh, I thought I was gonna die from fall damage. <laughs> I was like, please don't. Oh. That did it. It's a security override. I'll try to open the door from here. Ah, damn, it's jammed. I need to take a look at it. Here we go, boys. Put your back into it. You really think we can shut this thing down? I don't know yet. Sam's decoded part of the language. Now we'll see if I can have a conversation. With who? Who do you plan on talking to? Your mom. More like what? I think it's automated. Come Is it on. the Illuminati? These are the moments that make it all worthwhile. I'll oh, shut up now and pay attention because I have no idea what's what to Sam, say. begin translating. A moment. Indexing. Translation complete. Let's see what we have. <laughs> and he's getting eviscerated. <laughs> Oh shit. This is the part when uh, Ryder's dad is actually secretly a badass in disguise. Or he is wearing, and he is part of the N7, so. You look that well, now that we stand around looking at sunsets, let's get back to the shuttle and... Uh-oh. Oh my god. Oh, my helmet broke. How am I not dead? Oh, there we go. I'm sorry. Repeat. We need an emergency extraction now. They're spinning up the shuttle. ETA is three, maybe four minutes. We don't have that long. No, he's going to sacrifice himself. Daddy, no! Daddy, no! Daddy! Papa! I knew he was gonna die. He sacrificed his life to save ours. What a soldier. Oof. There's no oxygen in your body. You're Basically. Just a hardwired connection. Do it. There. Welcome back, Scott. Where's my daddy? Um, he's what happened? You were clinically dead for twenty two seconds. 
I was basically dead, and they brought me back. So I'm like Commander Shepard now. But he died for a whole like what five, ten years. Did the rest of the team make it? Hey, you're still with us, guys. Get to Sam Node. Riders awake. Who are you talking to? Sam. I didn't hear him. You're up. Look here. And here. My father. Where? He did. I'm sorry, Daddy. It was your life or his. And he chose you. I'm sorry, Scott. I know this must be a blow. I didn't know him. <laughs> he made the ultimate sacrifice. He got the team out of danger. We all owe him for that. He once said that when his time came, he wanted to go out among stars no one had seen before. My character looks sad. What are we doing in Sam, Node? Sam is now part of you. What? In a way we don't entirely understand. It played havoc with your brain. Sam? Your father authorized the transfer of Pathway to authority to you. Shouldn't that be Cora? In theory. In reality, you're the new Pathfinder, Scott. Huh? Are you kidding me? You can't be serious. <laughs> What's the matter? I think you're up for it. Uh, only if Cora agrees. It still goes against protocol. Cora, are you really okay with this? I won't stand in the way of your dad's decision. It's all academic anyway. Sam's linked to your mind on a deeper level now. Trying to untangle it could kill you. I know this is tough, but we need to start thinking about the next step. A lot of people are counting on us. Is the Ark still drifting? That's the thing. Whatever your dad did with that tower, it saved the day. Some sort of atmosphere scrubber. The energy cloud thinned out. We're on our way to the rally point now. Should be at the Nexus soon. He needs to rest first. He's got two hours. We'll need our Pathfinder for this. Oh, I checked on your sister. There's still no change. But if you can pull through, so can she. A bit of your dad in both of you. Sounds kind of gay. <laughs> your father will be missed. What's going on, Sam? This is our private channel. I shared it with him. What channel? He never mentioned anything about that. It allowed me to know him better. Alec wouldn't want us to lose sight of the goal. He said pain and boldness are resolved. He'd insist we grow stronger from his passing. Okay. That's fine. Cheap. Oh shit, is that like the Lord of the Rock people? It is the Lord of the Rock people. <laughs> it's a cool ass cape though. Oh shit, I see an N7, they're like, it's him, but daddy died, so. Oh 
Oh, they're washing him out. They're kind of, honestly, the Atrauna guys are fucking retarded. They didn't even protect this area. So no other, so not these guys can activate it. Oh, he can't do it. Aha, pussy, you can do it, but I can't, but my father can. I probably can too. Uh, let me guess, he's gonna find me and catch me alive and then use me for that. Yeah, look at that guy, man. So my guess, he's gonna try to kidnap me. Catch me alive and use me. Andre. Daddy Ryder, died. Good to see you on your feet. We're at the Nexus. It's the forward hub for the entire Andromeda initiative. The Asari, Solarian, and Turian arcs should be there too. Oh, cool. Let's hope they've had better luck. Starting our approach now. It's almost as big as the Citadel back home. Nexus Control, this is Arc Hyperion requesting docking clearance. Captain, I'm only getting their automated approach channel, not a live person. Well, like it or not, we're here. Take us in. Something bad. It sounds like I'm in death space for a minute. They're not even answering. Everything's historic. Well, maybe we could go through. Try right, calling them. Construction should have been finished by now. Could be worse. How? Habitat 7's a bust. We might have started a war with the first aliens we met, and our Pathfinder's dead. This better be rock bottom. Green across Damn, the he's pissed. Docking initiated. I mean, you can't blame him. I mean, his daddy died and everything went through shit. Already. Alright. I got us here. Good luck, Pathfinder. Thanks, Mom. Oh, we're here. Nice. You gonna be okay, Ryder? Yeah. The captain just called me Pathfinder. This is really happening. Just take a deep breath. I still can't believe Dad's dead. This should have been his moment. But now it's yours. You just need to decide what you're going to do with it. Where do I start? I'm just not sure I'm ready. We weren't ready to fall out of the sky on Habitat 7. But we survived that. Well. So, I said always keep a jump jet handy. Yeah, like the game design, I think it looks kind of eh. I think they try to make it look less Clado-y, like from the few games, like the other Mass Effect games, but like it kind of like what brought Mass Effect design look like. This actually looked like a trauma uh, version of, like a shitty, like non Clado version of him. I don't know, but the, the design in this game looks kind of eh. It looks whatever. I feel like Mass Effect 3 looks 10 times better, and even 2 looks 10 times better than this game. It'll be nice to see some friendly faces this time. The Nexus runs a support crew, just enough to finish building the station and provide safe harbor for the Arcs. Means we can start waking our people up. They built a bar, right? Gotta have champagne for the welcome party. You're expecting one? After what we've been through, I could use a buzz. We all could. Yeah. Rough ride so far. We'll bounce back. Real food and a shower are just ahead. Here we are. Alright. All right. Uh kind of weird, but okay. Uh I don't see any champagne. Where is everybody? Surprise. I'm Avina, a virtual intelligence designed to assist you with immigration. Uh, can you tell us where the welcome party is hiding? I'm sorry. My code is limited to information and simple interaction simulation. Please select from the following pre-programmed responses. That's all. 
It has been my pleasure. Please, Coach. Plants are still alive. There's a guy. Maybe he's got champagne. Hi there. Greetings, America. We're from Ark Hyperion and wondering where everybody went. Did he hear you? Did you say an Ark? This is the Nexus, right? Pretty sure we parked in the right place. And for what it's worth, your VI over there could use an update. Of course, I'm sorry. It's just, we thought you were all dead. What? Or captured, or lost in dark space, or... But you're here. You have no idea how much this means. I don't believe it. I'm Jiren Kandros. I lead our militia on the Nexus. He looks really cool. I guess armor. I'm Scott Ryder. This is Cora Harper and Liam Costa, part of the Pathfinder team. I'm sorry for the confusion. Our sensors told us an arc had arrived, but Helios is notorious for scrambling equipment. We thought you were just another malfunction. What's that? But aren't you expecting us? You're the first arc we've seen. After a year of waiting and no sign of the others, we shuttered this area and stopped looking. You've been stranded for a whole year? Longer. I'll fill you in on the way to Op Center. Everything that could go wrong with our plan has. We arrived 14 months ago. Right away, we hit a band of dark energy that knocked us off course. We're familiar with it. Then you'll know why we call it the Scourge. We lost whole sections of the station. A lot of people died. No power, no food. The chaos went on for months. It finally led to armed rebellion. When order was restored, the insurgents were banished. Exiles, we call them. Are things back to normal? Not even close. But you're here now, so maybe the worst is over. No word from the other Pathfinders? No word from anyone, period. I am. Any threats from the locals? So far, we've stayed hidden. We're in no shape to deal with an attack. We had a first contact situation on habit. We're here. <laughs> you guys go ahead. I'll check out the security situation. You should know our command structure has been fractured. Some of us are filling in for leaders who died. Is it true? They said drop everything and report for duty. And no one was expecting an ARC to finally show up. Docking procedures are green across the board. Stand by to merge Hyperion power into the grid. My dog sleep on my brother's bed. Got that anime hair. That fucking Final Fantasy haircut. The crew of the Hyperion. Good luck. Thank you. I'm Jaren Tan, director of the initiative. You have no idea how much your arrival means to us. We've heard about what happened, and we're ready to help. We could use any supplies you have. Food, water, we're short on everything. This is Foster Addison. She oversees colonial affairs. Where's the Pathfinder? You're, You're looking, looking at, him. at him. You're not Alec Ryder. My father's dead. He made me his successor. Alec is dead. Please understand, the entire initiative is at risk. None of the Golden Worlds panned out. They're a bust, and there's been no word from the other arts. What happened to them? Unknown. Our supplies are nearly depleted. Rationing bought us some time, but even that's running out. We need to find more resources. But that takes people, and we can't wake them up. Until they have somewhere to live. A Golden World. Now more than ever, we need a Pathfinder. It now falls to you, Ryder. Are you up to the task? I may not have been the first choice, but I'm ready for this. Youthful enthusiasm will only get you so far in Andromeda. That's no way to treat a guest. A big woman. I'm Nak Morkesh, superintendent of this station. I hope they haven't scared you off already. It's nothing personal, but now isn't the time for on-the-job training. 
At least the Pathfinder here seems willing to try. We could use a fresh perspective. You've heard my concerns. I'll leave you to it. We're all feeling the pressure. Let's have a private word in my office, Ryder. We'll discuss giving you a scout ship. I'm happy to work out the details with your associate. Welcome to the Nexus. Thank you for standing up for me there. Hope's in short supply here. What little we can find should have a chance Ma'am, the Hyperion's core is now online. Let me show you something. An hour ago, that was all dark. But with the power from your ship, you're keeping the lights on. You have my vote. And when the power runs out? You'd best go talk to Director Tan. Make sure that doesn't happen. And don't be shy. Come see me when you have a chance. Is she gonna suck my dick with her turtleneck? Damn, speak with oh my god, I gotta speak with a lot of people here, dude. This is Nexus control the Hyperion. Hang on guys, my dog wants to get off the bed. We are back. Oh. All right. Hello, everybody. I'm back. We're going to play like another two hours of this game, and then later tonight we'll play like. You know, we're, we're going to play uh, Halo 3 tonight. I feel like playing Halo 3. Because this game makes me want to play it. <laughs> so, yeah. We're going to play some Halo 3 afterwards. Alright, let's just get this conversation over with. Oh, my headset was on the entire time. That was off. I ain't shaking my fucking ability. Disembarkation procedures for Hyperion are on hold. Please await further instructions. This is the planet where we landed. Habitat 7. It wasn't even close to livable. That's been true of every world we found. Ryder, we were discussing your next expedition. About time. Good. I was starting to wonder who was in charge around here. Director Addison is entitled to her opinion, and mine overrules ours. Does she know that? I oversee the entire initiative, and I have decided to give you a chance to prove yourself. To that end, the score is dealt as a serious blow. Whatever it is, our scientists theorize it's not natural. An artificial energy cloud? It wasn't here when we left the Milky Way, yet it rendered all the golden worlds unlivable. Then there's the aliens you ran into, the Ket. They're obsessed with alien structures we found scattered around the cluster. They'll do anything to prevent others from accessing them. It seems murder isn't exclusive to the Milky Way. And now the challenge is to settle a world in spite of all that. This one here, Eel. Oh. You need to increase the viability of the planet so we can establish an outpost. Then we can bring more colonists out of stasis. The more colonists we have, the more resources we can gather to support the Nexus. Everything depends on it. There are six worlds we hope to settle. Okay, but you said every planet you found is unlivable. So, how do I... A good Pathfinder would relish the challenge of solving it. Right. I think I should go check on things. And if I fail, I guess it's no sweat off your back, right? You'll just look for another Pathfinder? Placing bets on people is part of my job. Some of them pay off. Others... 
Ain't your bitch. The way I see it, you need me. If I pull this off, maybe you'll look like the leader you pretend to be. But first, you have to succeed at being the Pathfinder you pretend to be. Damn. Where's my ship? They're prepping it now in the docking bay. The coordinates for EOS will be in the computer. And when you have a moment, we should discuss the missing arcs. I was wondering about that. Ah. Something wrong? Ryder, can you see me and Samnig on the Hyperion? Your implant needs attention, and we need to discuss a confidential matter. No, I'm fine. This console reports on the militia's current strike team missions, Pathfinder. Please speak with Tyrion Candrus for authorization to participate. That's the console for our strike teams. What are they? Assault and extraction squads. When we need the best, I have Apex, combat experts who've signed up to defend us. Since you have a front row view of the cluster, I can give you authority to dispatch them. I'll deploy your people carefully, Candros. Appreciate that, Ryder. But trust me, Apex can handle themselves. Authorization complete. Good luck out there. All personnel, be aware of the uh, security is on heightened alert. It's not right. It's not fair. What's wrong? Life's not fair, bitch. Oh my, you're so it's true. A Pathfinder has found us. There's hope at last. Maybe you could help. You're impartial. This whole thing has gotten so political. My husband, he's locked up and slated for exile for a crime he didn't commit. What was exactly was he convicted of? They don't exile you for petty theft. Well, maybe this bunch would. They say it's murder. They're calling him the first murderer in Andromeda. But the dead man was his friend. He wouldn't have. There are witnesses and evidence, but it's all circumstantial. At worst, it was an accident. His name is Milken Rensis. He could give you the details if you were willing to speak with him. Please. Of course. I'd be happy to. Oh, thank you. No, I'm sure forget. the jailer will allow you a visit. Please, tell Milken I love him. Help you? Pathfinder Rider, here to see Nilkin Rensis. Ah, our murderer. Wife's here all the time. Yes, she told you her sob story. Nilkin, you're moving up in the world. There's a Pathfinder wanted to chat with you. The Pathfinder, huh? They called in the big guns to exile Andromeda's first murderer. I'm not here to exile you. Told your wife I'd look into things. At this point, it's too late. They found me guilty. Why don't you tell me what happened? I was part of the futile effort to set up a colony on Eos. We were on our last legs, overrun by hostiles, our leader dead. The security chief, Reynolds, my friend, he refused to call for evacuation. I argued with him. Everyone saw. Last I checked, getting into a spat wasn't against the law. There's more. He ordered us to regroup and counterattack. We were moving through a sandstorm. Doesn't look like he, he was moving. ready to be so finished the again. Looked like he still need the ethos on him. I guess I panicked and fired. A witness saw the chief's chest explode. Sounds like an accident. That's what I told them. But I was enraged when we argued. There is a recording. It's it's ugly. Everyone's certain I did it on purpose so we could evacuate. Only my word otherwise. Don't throw in the towel yet. I'll review the evidence. Maybe I can find something that'll help. That would be great. You're a Pathfinder. I'm sure Kandros would give you access. Maybe there's still hope. Weapons and stuff. I got you covered. Use the console to take a look through what I got. 
It'd be a lot easier if I weren't missing half my stock. You got it. Shop till you drop. Here I come. That's fine. Hey, wait. Please don't drop anything you bought from me, okay? Tam would have my head if anything happened to you on my account. <laughs> oh, we got the N7 uh, cruiser. I don't have, dude, I have like only 123 credits, brother. Jesus Christ. I can't afford any of these. <laughs> I mean, I could afford ammo and shit, probably, but that's it. Uh, oh, well. I, you know, we'll come back and buy more shit. All right. We. Hey, you okay? I'm fine. My arms got the brunt of it. Stuff exploding like this happen often? Back right after the mutiny, we had a lot of this happening, but not lately. I wasn't there during the mutiny. Lucky. I thought we were done with this, honestly. But maybe I was just being paranoid. What is there to be paranoid about? We've had three malfunctions in the past week. That's not good. Sorry, understatement. Yeah. And now I have more repairs. Whoever's doing this has to be stopped before someone gets seriously hurt. That's what I'm trying to do. But I'm an engineer, not a PI. I've scanned all the potential sabotage areas I can think of. But I don't know who to trust anymore. Sounds like a lot went down before the Hyperion docked. Yeah, I guess. Wait, that's it. You can't possibly be involved in this. You weren't even here during the mutiny. Would you, if, if you have time? Maybe you could help me if they start hitting critical systems. All right. Sure thing. What can I do? If you could scan these other panels while I fix this one, that'd really help. I've sent the locations to your Omni tool. Just send me the data when you're done. Okay. I thought he just wants to talk to, or wants me to talk to somebody. Let's find out why. Be So basically, this is like the uh, the citadel, but like right, moving on. docking clamps. Dock. All right, what happened? To who? To whom? And your goddamn father? Sorry, my face is tired from dealing with everything, and right now I just want to know what happened with Alec. In the moment, it saved my life. But it seems my father meant for me to get the role eventually. It isn't hereditary. If we wanted an inbred monarchy, we could have left half our gene stock back home. Damn. <laughs> Not home. The Milky Way. This is home. This mess. We don't have a lot of options, Ryder. Maybe you'll prove your father right. After 14 months of failed colonization, forgive me if I don't hold my breath. You called my father Alec. No one does that. A lot of us joined the initiative because of his vision. What he shared of it, anyway. Were you friends? Or... I'm not your new mother, if that's what you're asking. 
or his friend. He hated that I didn't use his title, but no one's a pathfinder until they've path found something. Much like a colonial director without colonies. How do you fit into the Nexus leadership? I oversee the actual settlement effort. As the number of outposts is currently less than ideal, my influence is limited. As Tan is quick to remind me. Left a perfectly adequate career as a chief officer. Provincial capital, too. Only a new galaxy could pull me away. And here we are, idling. There must be some kind of plan for encountering hostile aliens. We can't have been that naive. We expected life, not an enemy that refuses to talk. They don't attack. They disinfect. We're nothing until we're bacteria. Sorry, 14 months and you stoop to poetry. That's how bad it is. Talk to Kandros if you haven't. He's unfortunately become the head of our military. Oh, ah, dude. And as soon as he realizes it, we're in the shit. You don't trust him? I trust him to defend us. My I do not bro. trust a rising military influence in a supposedly civilian initiative. We came here to make history, Ryder. Not repeat it. Ah, oh, goddamn poetry. There's also the strange technology. Has anyone studied that? We've tried. Not me. The brains in research. They're supposed to know their business. Ugh. The current excuse? The tech we dug up on Mars was more advanced, but it was plug and go. The tech here thinks different? I don't know. <clears throat> We've mostly avoided it. And from what the Hyperion logs say about Alec, maybe that's good. You've had no colony successes in over a year. How many tries is that? Less than you'd think. The Scourge, Spoiled Worlds, Exiles, Hostiles. We can't just plot down an outpost and expect picket fences. We need the Pathfinder and Sam to scout, evaluate, and inspire. The Initiative promised a goal. Andromeda has not cooperated. And if it had? Beautiful, utopian horseshit. Colonies that produce and support each other. The Nexus of Citadel, not headed by Tan. Or even me. Okay. Excuse me, Director Addison. Ryder? It's Pathfinder. Ryder, we're starving here. If we don't get a foundation of outposts to feed the initiative, we might as well be 600 years dead. Alec promised a lot. None of it panned out. That's what you're up against. Why people won't trust you. Why I don't trust you. What? what? Prove me wrong. Oh, bitches. I worked for you guys and you guys don't trust me? You guys are weak. These guys are fucking weak. This is what Shepard died for? Wow. Isn't that a fucking disgrace? I like he tried to correct her saying it's Pathfinder. You must be the Pathfinder. Wonderful. You and your Sam are exactly what He's a call. The other guy's a call. Thanks, Mr. Professor Herrick, my colleagues and I will work with your Sam and the data you gather to solve Andromeda's scientific mysteries. What fields do you study? Herrick's in the life sciences. I do planetary geology, oceanography, rocks and runoff. Isn't talking to you, bird boy. Not that we've had much to study with everyone cooped up for 14 months. But your data on the scourge flows like poetry. Now we can better advise on repairing the damage it caused. And maybe Addison will give us a real workspace. Who can think with all this racket? Liam. You're in the forest? What district? Moss. Well, hang on, guys. Let me, uh... Let me change the, th the thumbnail real quick, because I didn't have any thumbnails at all for this game. So I just took an image on, on uh, Google. Obviously, Google Images. So since I already took screenshots in games, we could use those. 
So bear with me on this, sir. Uh. <laughs> That's actually a good thumbnail right there. <laughs> I'm gonna use that. <laughs> uh, let me see. Browse the screenshot, get the screenshot, click that. Uh, save as. Back to that, click that, click that. And then we're going to back uh, to over here. Yeah. Down, and then we're gonna change the thumbnail to uh -uh. There we go. There we go. I changed it, baby. I changed it, my boy. But hello everybody, if you guys are watching me on Twitch or on YouTube, hello everybody, welcome to the stream. Uh, we're playing Mass Effect Andromeda, which is, I never really played it, I skipped this game because I thought, because honestly, I hear so much bad shit during the time when it was first released and the game wasn't that popping, everyone hated it, so I didn't bother playing it. But uh, it was on sale on uh, Steam, and since we already finished the Mass Effect, uh, or since we were doing the Mass Effect uh, trilogy thing, Eating the game on stream and all that. I never. I'm like, mine, mine as well, since it is part of the uh, of the of the Mass Effect universe. So fuck it. <laughs> and um, even with Halo, like I want to play all the Halo games, but the only two Halo games I'm not, I can't stream is the uh, Halo Wars Two and Halo Five Guardians because they're not on on PC for some reason. I don't, I don't know why, but it is what it is, right? So, and I don't own an, uh, an Xbox, and I don't want to have a shitty console to play two shitty games. I mean, one shitty game. I know uh, Halo Wars 2 has a good protagonist, but otherwise, um, <laughs> yeah, it is what it is, right? But, you know, I do want to stream Halo Wars 1, because apparently it's like apparently it's supposed to be like the very first Halo, and then Halo Reach, and then... No, I think it was Halo Wars 1 and 2, it didn't Reach, or Halo Wars... And then Halo Reach, and then Halo One, and then it was Halo Wars Two, I believe, or some shit. I don't know. But we're playing the game as an order. Um, Halo Wars is a different game feel, but because it's like more of a strategist game, which is cool. I don't mind strategist games. I, you know, I love them. But like, <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna play a uh, Halo Wars eventually. But uh, but for right now, Mass Effect Three or er, a trauma er, baby. I want to make sure if everything's good. Just want to make sure. Yeah, to later, um, within like an hour, like another hour, we're going to end the stream and then we're going to uh, play Halo 3 afterwards. So it's going to be a lot of fun. So, if you guys want to see some Halo 3, but don't worry, boys, we're on it. Holy shit, we got 408 subs. What the fuck? I know I know somebody sub like a, like like the beginning of the stream, but I wasn't expecting more subs right now. Probably because of the uh, shorts. Yeah, it's just a short probably. I think there was more people watching it. I know I know somebody sub like a, like the beginning of the stream, but I wasn't expecting more subs right now. But anyways, so. I was just checking the audio, and so I gotta like make sure. I was just making sure if the thumbnails is good there. All right, let's go, baby. But yeah, so far the game's not that uh, bad. I think it's all right so far. Pathfinder, no time for our big Pathfinder. Yet. This place is a mess. Security is it? Let's call it strained. I can believe it. The Nexus is running on empty. Not just that. A lot of the exiles were security. 
Everyone was trained and armed for Frontier. We know Ket are dangerous, and now we have to worry about our people too. No idea where they went, but they left mad. They were frustrated. If they just wanted to kill, they could have fought to the last here. Apparently we're the big hope for everyone. Not the Hyperion showing. Just us. I'm with you. It's just... a lot. As long as the Nexus is here, as long as we're here, we have a job to do. Double down crisis mode. I can do that. We can do that. Ready and willing, Pathfinder. Sorry guys, my dog had eight hair off the floor, so I gotta kick the hair out of his mouth. He always do that. And it, it, it's even worse for me because I have long hair and he always eats the hair is on the floor. So like it's really annoying and sometimes the hair have you ever have a dog? If you do have a dog or, or a pet. Or like the, just a a dog. I, I don't know if cats do it, but I mean obviously they lick their fur, but like then they shoot at hairballs, but they can like die from it by choking on their hairball. That's right, it's dangerous. But like, um, what was it? Like, have you have you pet ever like took a shit and then like the shit is connected with a long strand of hair, so you kind of have to gently pull out the poop, even though the hair is like inside the butthole. It's always like the worst because they get, sometimes my dog kind of freaks out a little, so like it's hard to get it out. And then sometimes I'm like, all right, I gotta do it quick before he freaks the fuck out. <laughs> so you know, it'd be like that sometimes. It looks like there's something else over here. I'm, I'm I'm exploring this place, by the way. I'm always just trying to see what kind of missions we can get. But yeah, guys, if you guys are just, just tuning into my channel, hi, welcome to the world. Uh, welcome to the world of Immortal Muffin. Um, we're playing uh Mass Effect uh Atromina, or basically Mass Effect Five, because they're making four. You can skip four and five, but um. Yeah, I'm very excited to uh, beat this game. We are going to beat Mass Effect Atromina. I'm very curious how it's going to end. But uh, I wonder if they're going to make a part. I'm pretty sure they can make a part 2 of Atromina 2. Like after probably Mass Effect 4, it'll be like Atromina 2 next. Right. You may have but yes, I'm a, vi I'm a variety I uh, streamer. I stream other games. I don't focus on one game. I used to focus a lot on Halo. Uh, not Halo, but I used to focus a lot on uh, Fortnite. And uh, sure, Fortnite was my go-to game for for a, for, a, for a long time actually for streaming. But I was never really good at it, but yeah, I stream other games now. Like I'm trying to you know mix it up a bit. Like, you know, we're playing like zombie games, first-person shooters, survival games, uh, open-world games, uh, 2D games. You know all that shit. You know any game that I played it that, from my childhood or games I do enjoy or other games I never tried out before, I'll try it out on stream. Like we played that in Fall Two, that was really fun, and um, on a uh, we we beat that on a. Uh, it was like a three uh part, but like because the storyline wasn't that long, but like it was really fun and cool, and one of my moderators, Grim, he told me about it. He's like, "Oh, you should play it. It'd be cool." I was like, "All right, fuck it." No, I told him I bought it. He's like, "Oh yeah, that game's really awesome." I bought it before I I even uh, told him. I'm like, "Oh yeah, I bought Titanfall Two by the way for like three bucks on Steam because it was on sale during that time, so it was pretty cool," and um. So, you know, I'm trying out all the other games. I'm also going to do, like, Call of Duty games, like, Black Ops. I'm probably going to do, like, the whole Black Ops uh, saga first. Because I know, like, there's, like, different universes of certain games. Like, Black Ops has their own universe. And Modern Warfare has their own universe. And all this other shit. So, we are going to do those separately. I'm not going to test, like, the Black Ops and the Modern Warfare stuff yet. But I am going to, like, uh, play the very first Call of Duty games all the way up to the, uh, I guess, where they started the Black Ops title. And they would play Black Ops. And then, you know, all that shit. I do enjoy playing Black Ops. Uh, I I love the Black Ops uh, Call of Duty games a lot more. I don't know why. I think it's a little bit more uh, sci-fi because I kind of like that. And um, I'm very excited to play it. But, you know, we got to do that later because <laughs> there's a lot of Call of Duty games. <laughs> a lot. But, like, um, we'll, we'll get to it, though. Don't worry. It'll be great. They're as much a part of the initiative as the human arc. But we'll find them. We have to. But yeah, thank you guys for subbing to my channel, by the way. I really do fucking appreciate it, man. I really do hope that we could hit like 500 subs pretty soon, just because we could be, uh, I could be a uh, YouTube, uh, so we could have like a YouTube membership thing on chat. 
but we have like super chat we'll have all this cool shit we can have like special uh perks i guess like kind of like emotes on the in the chat like my own custom emotes i don't know how i do that yet but once we hit 500 um if we reach 500 i'm pretty sure we will but like i am gonna like search it up how to do it because <laughs> i'm like i don't know <laughs> so um i'm gonna try to make some special perks and shit like that but uh but yeah so i think it'd be kind of cool it sounds like the Nexus has had a rough time of it. Publicly, I would say we're more than up for the challenge. Privately, I can tell you it's been a disaster. The Scourge killed hundreds, many of them our senior leadership. Even the founder of the initiative, Gene Garson, is dead. How did Gene Garson die? With the rest of the leadership. When the Nexus hit the Scourge, a large wing of stasis pods was destroyed. They were killed instantly. These people traveled 600 years and died before they even woke up. Jean Garson never glimpsed Helios. She never saw her vision realized. Kendris mentioned something about hitting the Scourge. How did it play out? Criminal elements took advantage of the emergency and preyed on people's fears. An uprising followed. We had no choice but to turn to the Krogan to deal with them. They crushed the mutiny and the criminals were banished. Exiles, we call them. I doubt we've heard the last of them. They're led by an outlaw, Sloane Kelly. She used Slow to Kelly? Hours. What the fuck is Slow Kelly? Who is this Sloane slow Kelly? Kelly. She was Who's slow? Security on the Nexus. She Why do you call her slow? Because she's slow in the brain. She eventually brain? turned traitor and joined them. Misguided sympathy for the plight of the common citizen. Nonsense. They posed Nonsense. a direct threat to our existence. Where are the Krogan after, you know? There don't seem to be many Krogan around. Good riddance. Damn, the racist. They demanded a greater say in political matters. The last place you want them involved? Their muscle, nothing more. Good for fighting and lifting heavy objects. When they didn't get what they wanted, they left. Why are racist? Krogan? It's common knowledge that they are a violent, ignorant species. Long racist. ago, they waged nuclear war on one another. Their planet was decimated. Was My fun. people tried to uplift them, but the Krogan could never tame their worst instincts. What if they bring their tempers to Andromeda? We'll all be dead. What more can you tell me about the initiative? It represents the greatest migration ever attempted. No one had ventured beyond the Milky Way before. We've all left home in search of freedom, fortune, perhaps a new beginning. We are the bravest souls each species has to offer. I hope the Nexus will serve as the seat of government for us. I'm glad they still have books here so they, you know, it's not all digital. Pretty sure books are probably like more harder to get. Definitely around like the future, <laughs> you know what I mean? Why do you think most people came? There are Yo, came. reasons. One for every colonist here. What does any pilgrim seek? Usually, happiness. Finding the thing that eludes them. The thing to fulfill them. While we cannot promise they will find it, we can facilitate the search. What do you know about the early days of the initiative? As most everyone knows, Jean Garson's vision made it happen. She was an entrepreneur on Earth. Wealthy. Young for a human. Carson had the idea for the initiative in the early 2170s, I believe. Many thought leaving the Milky Way was impossible. But she persevered. And as with most great ideas, the doubters were wrong. It looks like a melting pot around here. The Nexus is home to several initiative species. Many came ahead of the Arcs. The hope is that this station will one day serve as the governing body in Andromeda. Though I'm not sure what they were thinking, lumping Krogan into the mix. As a Salarian, my kind tend to have a low opinion of them. Nothing I've seen here has changed that. I still think it's crazy how they die at the age of 40. Because they age really, really fast. So this guy is like over 400, 600 years old. Definitely he outlived it. <laughs> uh, I'm done. Uh, wait, fuck! What's Tan's role about this shit? As director of the initiative, are you in charge around here or what? If the others would allow me, 
they don't see me as the rightful successor. Grimlock? Why the doubt? What's their problem with you? I am not Jean Garth. Because you're racist? Our founder was charismatic, eccentric, larger than life. Traits I cannot hope to mimic. She and her inner circle perished in the scourge, some at the hands of the exiles, some never made it out of stasis. I was deputy assistant for revenue management. Then all seven leaders above me died. I was next in line for the role. So, you're an accountant? Don't let that fool you. We are all capable of more than we know. When I was young, I was fascinated by the idea of exploring space. Life had its detours, and I, I, might, I was scratching the door. I was like, dude, it's open. I heard about the initiative and saw my chance to try the path not taken. While I may not be setting foot on new worlds, my authority can ensure that you do. Right. Sorry. Who's Gridlock? So how does anything get done? In theory, Cash handles the next the physical off. operations, Kandros runs the militia, and Addison manages colonial affairs. I oversee all of it. In practice, we argue, debate, and yell at each other until a decision is made. If we're lucky. And I'll up you it up. is maddening. Um, sorry. What do I need to consider in making a planet viable? Assuming the planet supports life, an outpost is critical. People like a roof over their heads, and you'll want to eliminate any hostile threats. Whether that's the cat or other terrors lurking in Helios, colonists being murdered on sight can be discouraging. Also, scouting and mapping terrain is a priority for any Pathfinder. And don't forget forward stations. You'll want those. What can you tell me about forward stations? I was afraid you'd ask. It's most I'm afraid you ask. Me. <laughs> a forward station allows mining, equipment uh, repairs, and resupply for field teams. I mean, who wouldn't want that? But seeing as how every colonization effort has failed, it's just theory at the moment. You get to test it out, Ryder. That sounds fun. Any more information you can give? I don't me know why you said it that way. <laughs> no, and that is the distressing part. The Asari, Turian, and Salarian arcs are completely unaccounted oh, for. You almost got a fellow. If they had the same problems with the scourge that we did, I fear the worst. Should you find any clues, that ain't my dog, by the way. He's on my way. Without the other arcs, the promise of. If you guys don't know who's Buster is, I mean, okay. Uh, Forward Street. So yeah, my dog is right here. Um, he's the mascot of my profile picture. Worcester Judge. Try to show his face. Here he is. Um, he's like rubbing his whole head on my lap. So, just, you know, he's enjoying it. Oh, hi, everybody. <laughs> I never went full screen virtual before, but I mean, you know, it's pretty decent enough. But anyways, let's uh, get back to the game. Oh, somebody subscribed two hours ago? Oh, it subscribed two hours ago. Let me show their name now. That's it. I don't know if it will play it, but... <laughs> Barbara, the VTuber. Wait, Barbara the VTuber followed me? Is a VTuber's what? Wait, what? No way. You're telling me there's a VTuber's what? what? Subscribe to me? I mean, follow me on Twitch. Crazy. How can I still say Dragon's Dogma? I'm not even playing it. Like, oh, you want to be tired in Dragon's Dogma? I'm like, no. All right, goodbye, sir. That's all. Thanks for your time. Of course. I feel like I talked to him. Out. Oh, sorry. We I feel like I talked to him about each other. Our oh, futures depend on each other's success. It would have been cool if we could actually choose to be what race you want, uh, want as a as a um in the game. Cause that would be a lot cooler. Like same voice actor. 
voice acting, but just like a different body. Like a different alien body. I think that that's that was a missed opportunity. Ryder could have been like an alien. Why is it always a human? Why are we always limited to be a human? I want to be an alien. That's what I hope Mass Effect 4 introduce a, a like we can actually customize our, our instead of being a human, we can be an alien. I think that would have been a lot a lot cooler. And uh yeah. I right, just do the main mission. I'm kinda of bored already. I know that look. The others bent your ear, did they? Something like that? You get used to it. Just focus on being a pathfinder. Can't argue with results, though they'll try. Anyway, welcome to Militia HQ. Excuse the mess. This office fields militia work, nexus security, and... You like his armor, though. ...for the Turian Ark. What's the word on the Turian Ark? Okay. Scattered readings. Some indicate the Natanus was destroyed. Others, that people are alive. Who knows? If you need anything, come see me, even if it's just a vent. I spoke with Nilk and Rensis, the man found guilty of the murder on Eos. Yes, our first murder here in Andromeda. I wish it had been our last. When the colony attempts failed, it didn't help the spirits that a high-ranking officer was killed by one of our own. The mutiny here on Nexus was probably inevitable, but this acted as a spark. It doesn't seem right to put all that on him. Of course it isn't, but that's the perception. Despite the lack of physical evidence, everything added up. His only defense was, trust me, I didn't mean to do it. That is the difference between murder and accidental death. In this case, motive plus opportunity plus eyewitness account equals murder. Look, True. murder is so bad. A key witness, Cassidy Shaw, works in operations. Go ahead and talk to her. Operation. And there's a recording of the perpetrator threatening the victim. I'll let you cue it up on the console there. As far as I'm concerned, this case is closed. What brought you out here to Andromeda? I was tired of being the good one. The good one? The Kandros family is old military. There were expectations, you know. Then my sister became a sculptor and cousin Nyreen went pirate on Omega. Everyone was proud that I stayed in service. But I kept wondering, when do I get my adventure? Jen Garson's dream was so grand, so gutsy, I had to be part of it. Interesting. You talk like you weren't part of the leadership. How did you end up commanding the militia? I was escorting a prospecting team on some moon notes. when those cat found us. They penned us like cattle for experiments. I managed to get loose, snatched a gun, and freed the others. By the time we killed the bastards and headed back to war in the Nexus, everyone looked at me like I was in charge. That sounds familiar. The militia grew from there. Funny, once the heat is on, all kinds of people rise to the top. Are the other Turians managing okay? So, so. Oh. We're not good at sitting around in a crisis. Service before self gets drummed into us at boot camp. That's probably why so many of us are in the militia. We like to earn our citizenship, whatever galaxy we're in. But it's hard to focus with our arc missing. Kit? What do you know about the enemies we've encountered? The Ket. Oh, Ket. We usually see them on worlds with those alien structures. Uh. Ket don't take kindly to anyone studying them. Not sure why. They don't talk to us. Every time we cross paths, there's a fight or they take prisoners. Why? What do they want? No one knows. But I've seen their weaponry and what they do to those prisoners. I want them a long, long way from the Nexus. So that means it's really, really bad. <laughs> this is just like the main threat, I guess, in this area of the galaxy. So we're in the new area of a galaxy. All right, so this is what I'm guessing. So after the, the invasion of uh, the Reaper 600 years ago, I guess Earth was still kind of fucked. Because the Reaper like kind of like basically destroyed Earth. So now they're trying to find a new Earth, which is... Kind of like what they found, but now they try to find new colonies to like, you know, because I guess their old homes are super fucked over, <laughs> even over six hundred years because of the fucking reapers. And now they're like trying to find new planets to live on. It's rough out there. I might need backup if you can spare the people. I have ah, teams God. specializing in assault and extraction. If you need serious firepower, my Apex teams have ah. you covered. But that isn't news to you, right? Bye. Bye, Kandros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. Oh, my pill got stuck behind my throat. The 
Texas versus Colin of Milken, Evidence 7A. Hiram! Hiram! They've seized the compound! Call for evacuation! We're not giving up, Milken. We're taking it back. No! I'm not letting your ego get us killed! Even if I have to... No! Get him off me! Get him off me! It does sound like murder. Honey, I think your husband did murder him. She's like, no, he didn't. And I'm like, yeah, you Cassidy Shaw, I'm Scott Ryder. I'm looking into the Nilkin murder case. Oh, man, I thought that was over with. Have you heard the audio recording of their fight? Yes. I helped pull him off Chief Reynolds. You could see it in his eyes. He was going to kill him. Then in the sandstorm, I had a pretty clear view of the chief. He looked white at Nilkin and shouted, no. Then his chest burst open. I'll never forget it. The look on his face was pure shock. Did you see any cat in the vicinity? Nilkin said so, but not that I could see. Still, the sandstorm was severe. Visibility wasn't great. Did Nilkin seem remorseful? I lost sight of Nilkin in the turmoil. When we found him, he seemed in shock. He couldn't speak. He looked nauseated. Could have been guilt. The reality of the act sinking in. Did my dog beat on me? Or I think that's... If they'd fought and Nilkin threatened to kill him, why was Reynolds surprised? Friends fight, say things they don't mean, maybe even hurt each other. But you don't expect your best friend to shoot you. Uh. To me, that's the saddest part. The chief's heart was broken right before it exploded. Reynolds was leading you back to retake the compound. Did you agree with that? It wasn't my place to agree or disagree. He was ranking officer. In retrospect, it is ironic. If he hadn't been killed, we all probably would have died. Thank you. I appreciate the information. Well, thank you. It kills me we had to leave him behind. He deserved a proper funeral. So the body was never examined? Important piece of a murder investigation. Yeah, you dumbasses. Cam wouldn't allow a mission to go back for him. Said it was too dangerous. <clears throat> and if there was no body to recover, then the guy still should be in custody and not be a murderer. Something I can help you with? I'm looking into the Nilkin Rensis murder charge. And? I want to go to EOS <laughs> and retrieve Chief Reynolds' body. That isn't usually Pathfinder business. First murder in Andromeda, and I'm impartial. Figured you'd want to get it right. Settling an outpost comes first. But I suppose I have no objections. Physical evidence will only bolster the case. The more certain we can be, the better. All right, but let's keep it quiet. I don't want people thinking we're reopening the case. I hope anything you find reaffirms what's been done. But if it sheds a different light, we'll deal with it. We'll send the coordinates of the murder scene. Good luck. That's all. Thanks for your time. Of course. All right. Reading. Let's get the murder evidence. No news on the Turian Arc yet. Or is this militia business? Bye, Kandros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. A oh, new enemy is nice. Apex mission. What? Um. Eh. 
And this is protect equipment, why not? Wait, what is that? Play in multiplayer? No. Is, wait, is this supposed to be a multiplayer game? Huh? This is multiplayer. What the fuck? No. Never knew this game had a multiplayer. Unless I read it wrong, like dumbass. <laughs> I don't know. I think my dog had wet pee on his fucking crotch and then he just stained my pants. I just put like. I am playing on online. What the fuck? Never knew that. Apex. Yo, they stole this from Apex Legends? What the fuck? Play multiplayer. I thought we were I thought we were doing the main mission or some shit. No, it was just multiplayer shit. I didn't even know this game had multiplayer. What the hell? What the hell just happened? Yeah, this looks similar to the Citadel. I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be like the Citadel, but like I never played it. All the shaders it has to load in, dude. There you go. For a while, it wouldn't let me fucking save it. Marco, no. We can start building the fence to the fence. Escape the murder case. So where the fuck do I go now? Tracks, the saboteur is overloading power to this panel from another junction relay. You can scan and trace the connective wiring to locate the surrogate panel. That a big boy. Why can't you just Sam? Why can't you just be a hot AI? Scan and trace trick? the wiring to locate the panel that the saboteur used. All right. Oh, am I supposed to follow it? I'm like, he's there. So I guess we're not here. Scanning power junction relays. This panel is malfunctioning. Without more data, I cannot determine if this is a normal malfunction or sabotage. I'll just disable power to the panel until Raj can check it out. I got it. Personnel, 
scanning. This panel has been tampered with. Send the data to Raj. Yes, Pathfinder. Thank you. Hey, Cash. There you are. Hope the others haven't been giving you a hard time. They did. There's a lot that needs doing. At least with the Hyperion hooked up and feeding us power, my team and I can get more work done. I notice there aren't a lot of Krogan around. Tan, ask him why most of my people left. He'll have opinions. I can tell you this much. When the mutiny happened, a deal was made. My clan were supposed to settle matters and in return, get more say in the initiative. Did the deal go through? The clan held up their part, but Tan had a meltdown when he found out we wanted more say around here. Then Addison's assistant, Spender, pretended he never made the deal in the first place. It was a mess, but I don't blame my people for walking out. We're done being used. Amen, sister. Are you still here, then you dumb bitch? With your clan gone, why did you stay? It's complicated. The station and my clan both need me here. What sort of problems have you seen on the Nexus? Situations gone to shit pretty much sums it up. There's arcs missing. Some idiots tried to mutiny and take over, then more idiots defended my clan, so they left. And to top it all off, the founder of the initiative, Jean Garson, was killed. What happened to Jean Garson? Killed in the Scourge disaster. Her and a bunch of the other leaders. Tan might know more. And I thought the Hyperion had a bad when we arrived. Anything else? The outposts aren't happening because we don't have resources or people, so Addison's more uptight than ever. And let's not forget how badly the station was damaged on arrival. But that's a detail, according to some. My team and I are repairing what we can. If we don't get materials soon, things will go downhill. Fast. When we left the Milky Way, the Krogan were still dealing with the Genophage. Right. The Genophage. A little gift to our people from the Solarians thousands of years ago. That sterility virus they infected us with left most of our children stillborn. Only one in a thousand survived. No wonder your people have such a problem with Solarians. Some wounds never heal. Not that my ancestors didn't provoke it. They did try to conquer the galaxy. The Salarians were forced to respond. And it's not fair to blame it all on them, either. The Salarians developed the virus, but it was the Turians who deployed it. I'm hoping that's all in the past. Plenty of blame to go around, but Andromeda is about new beginnings. My people need that more than most. What about the Krogan here in Andromeda? There's no cure for it. <coughs> but my clan was starting to show a mutation against the virus. A natural defense. During the trip to get here, Krogan underwent gene therapies to enhance the mutation while we were in stasis. So you used those 600 years to your advantage. Gave the adaptation more time to develop. Yeah. It's still early, but I think we made a dent. Our scientists say we've improved viability to almost 4%, which is a lot better than what we had. Beyond all the statistics, it means more Krogan children will live. It's the only way my people have a future out here. What kind of work do you do, <coughs> Superintendent? I was part of the team that originally designed and built this place. I keep the station functional, or as functional as possible, considering. Alright. Nothing more for now. Try not to die out there. Sound like somebody in my, um... But... <laughs> Alrighty, let's continue on with the game. Station sabotage. <laughs> but first, I kind of want to explore this area. Oh, Kara, what's up? Hey there. You okay? Those guys really grilled you. And Addison, first Pathfinder they've seen in over a year. All she can do is question your competence. He 
Yeah. Meeting Addison was... interesting. She doesn't know you. I do. And you're doing fine. I appreciate it. I worked out logistics with Director Taylor. I know you can romance They're this They're giving bit. us a ship and crew. He said their best is taking care of it. I still need to head back to the Ark and check in with Sam. Sounds good. While you're there, maybe see how your sister's doing. Oh, alright. I'll make it work, Dad. I promise. You go, McCoy. Pathfinder, I'm Nigel McCoy. Oh, Nigel. Just got out of cryo. Welcome to Andromeda, Nigel. Thank you. It's bittersweet, though. My little brother, Dash, was stationed on the Nexus. I just learned he died on Eos, trying to start the settlement. Sorry, man. That's awful. I'm sorry, Nigel. Yeah. We were going to start families out here together. That's Gabe. I have a pendant to our father wore. Dash had its match. Will you... reunite them? Of course. In his digital journal, he mentioned a spot on Eos where he'd go to think. If you could leave the pendant there. Imagine naming your kids issue. Sure. That's brilliant. That was some expedition, hey? Oh, you kiss one like a fish. Why not just name fish? Fisher, sure. here we go. And Kirkland's the first casualty. Wish it could have gone differently. I'm sure there are decent aliens here in Andromeda too. We just have to find them. Well, I heard you're Pathfinder now. The sooner you figure out where they're hiding, the better. Will do. Chin up. Can't talk to you because you're not important. You're not important to talk to. What's up, Ace? Ryder. Hey, Ace. How's the wound? Doc says I'll live. So this goes from a life-threatening gunshot to a story I'll tell my grandkids someday. With no need to exaggerate, that was a tough fight on Habitat Seven. <laughs> Just glad it's to pretty be on easy. the other side of it. Oh, I didn't know there was more room over here. What the fuck? Oh, these are all the cryopods of people sleeping. Biogenics. Huh? Greer, how are you feeling? Grateful. If you and Liam hadn't found me in that cave, God knows what those aliens would have done. We couldn't leave a man behind. Yeah, your father, Kirkland. We'll never forget their sacrifice. Up in the you found, found your sister in law on Mass yeah. Effect 3. On Mass Effect? Seems unfair. Um, I don't think I did. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm not Maybe? With you, but I don't know. I'm trying to talk to everybody, but at the beginning, I kind of like just went with the story. I was like, fuck all anymore. that. I'm with this. Understood. Habitat 7 was a nasty. Um, I say no. Take care, Greer. Oh, I think maybe. Maybe so. Thanks again. I don't know. Possibility. Oh, great. Now you, I got to talk to you, Dr. Howlar. Damn shame about your dad, though. I'm sorry we couldn't save him. He did, he, you did your bite. I'm sure you did everything you could. Yeah, but still, we lost a Pathfinder on my watch. Doesn't sit right. My dad knew the danger. Part of the job. Now I just need to make sure your sister here pulls through. Wait, my sister, where is she? Where is she? Are you staying here on the Hyperion? You know that moment so, Muffin, why do you think I'm a guy? Too 
Because your name is Sniper Killer, uh, so I thought it was a boy's uh, name. Right. Look who I'm talking to. I thought you were like, like, I thought, I honestly thought you, maybe you were like around like, 50, you're like a 15 year old boy the, uh, watching my content. And I was like, oh, cool. Because your, because your, uh, because your, your username is the Sniper Killer, so it's not like anything feminine at all. So I always thought it was a a male's name. A sniper killer sounds like a uh, it sounds like a Call of Duty uh kid in a like some like fifteen year old boy, but uh you know the more you know I guess <laughs> that's why I'm pretty sure maybe you you could try to ask Grim if when when if or when he shows up in the chat you could ask him like do I do you do you think I'm a boy or a girl and he'd be like boy, <laughs> but he he doesn't give a shit either so he doesn't care. Would be shocked. I mean, I mean, he'd probably be like, "What the fuck?" Or like, "Oh, I knew." I'd be like, "How?" What will you do here? What will you do on the Hyperion? We still have thousands of people taking a nap here, and they need tending to. And this way, I can look out for Sarah. It was your username in Call of Duty. I fucking knew it. How's my sister? How's Sarah doing? Her condition's stable. I see signs of REM activity in the brain, so she's dreaming. Means all the wiring still works. How'd this happen? It was dumb luck, really. We hit the scourge at the worst possible moment, just as the stasis revival was kicking in. It's a vulnerable moment, coming out of a 600-year nap, then wham! Circuits fried and overloaded the neural pathways. Don't worry, I'm on it. We're not losing another rider. How did you end up with the initiative? I don't like this camera angle, dude. This is stupid. Why is it like not in the middle or like to the side? It's like it's cut out to the right, and all you can see is like seventy five percent of the bed and that shit, and the disco ball. And you see like ten twenty percent of this. This, this is not. This is not. Good. This is shit. This camera angle is dog shit. Whoever improved this, you sh um. I hope they stubbed their toe. This is terrible. Even from a point of view. Thanks. Don't be a stranger. If anything changes, but never Sarah, play my life. You know. Wait, you never play Call of Duty before? But you say yes, it's from Call of Duty though. So how? So if you never play Call of Duty, then how do you got the name from Call of Duty? Wait, I'm. You're making me confused. Like you're killing. You're a child. Yo, I didn't know this game had multiplayer, dude. I just like I ex I kind of like randomly stumble across. The game. <laughs> I was like, wait, this is multiplayer? Nope. All right, whatever. You you're confusing me, sniper killer. You said yes, I didn't know. So I thought like you're yeah. Like. Uh, this is. How do you? Any idea as to who it might be? Yeah. All these panels were worked on by Zara. I just can't believe it. Security video logs confirm that Zara Kellis worked on these panels, as well as the one Raj Patel encountered. Your OG name oh, was uh, Gamer Any idea where she is now? Kellis is currently like working lost on her a panel. Account. Oh, dude, that sucks. Ah, oh, shit, I got uh, confirm the saboteur. So I guess we figured out who sabotages all that crap. Right. Oh man, this loading screen looks terrible. <laughs> oh. Why are you crouching? What, 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 I think he's taking shit. Run! You bitch! Zara Kellis? You bitch! Yes? I have evidence you've been sabotaging the Nexus. What? 
No, I've never... I've been looking into this myself. I have the scans to prove it. Here. I'll transfer the scans I took to your Omnitool. Funny. Raj was investigating the same thing. And it led us to you. My scans point at Raj as the one. So unless someone was setting us both up, I just don't understand. The data Miss Callis has accumulated is strangely similar to Mr. Patel's. A third party seems likely. Looks like someone is using both you and Raj to cover their tracks. They need pretty high level access for that. Still, it's better than thinking Raj could have done this. But it means all the data I have is useless. Wish I had access to the security cams. I bet we could find something there. You stay put, so whoever did this doesn't realize we're onto them. I'll check out the security cams. Raj, you there? Yes. How did it go? Is it... Is it really her? Wasn't her. She had proof pointing at <laughs> you. I figure someone's been messing with you <laughs> Just keep a low profile and don't talk to anyone. I'm on it. <laughs> Ryder. You're not on the bridge, Captain? Uh. We powered it down. Can't afford to waste energy. Though Cryo Bay and Sam Note are exempt. And I told them to keep their hands off Alex quarters. You have access now. Thanks. Hey, sorry about your father. He was really good at what he did. Like fucking you hard? Not so good at working with people. He was right about going planet side though. I'll miss him. I wish you were still here. There's so much you could have taught me. He seems like a badass though. Fine. I like him. You're off to a good start. If there's anything else I can help with, let me know. Uh, what's your role, bitch? Even though you're the captain. Is dark. What'll you do? Normally, I'd supervise thawing out. The oh, you say sniper wolf? I thought I thought you meant sniper killer. Oh, never mind. You're the one helping resolve the issue. Yeah, I know sniper wolf. Everyone what hates her that? though on YouTube. Like everybody fucking hates her, dude. Everybody hates her. If someone had told you that you'd be in the I don't hate her. I think like even five years you know, ago. Because she doesn't do, like, she does reactions, but, like, she doesn't really react to anything. Although the way things are now isn't exactly Apparently she's still content and all that shit, and her boyfriend looked like a fucking Bob. Then, like, her boyfriend's suing her because, like, when you sign up, I guess it's a, uh, hope for the best a like, and contract plan for the worst. problem. I mean, her ex-boyfriend looked like a piece of shit anyways, like, but look at him. Pretty sure he was high as shit, too, in that picture. Why did you join the initiative? We're a long way from home. How could I not? Oh, I need to get my phone. I love my job. My phone to get my here. Phone. I need my charger to get my. I need it. Fuck! I need to get my charger. Do. Sailing through new stars, discovering new worlds. What self-respecting explorer could pass that up? Ugh. Ugh. I heard like a. I pay, I pay, I paid her. I paid her. I pay, I pay. She tossed and <laughs> boo people's houses. Oh yeah, oh yeah, she doxes people's houses. And she dox, um, I forgot who she doxed though. I know, I, I, I've seen it before. She doxed somebody. And she was stalking someone too. It was weird. She was a weird bitch. Thanks for the talk. All right. You look like a fail actress this for this Disney Channel. That's what she looks like. Up. Better get to it. Good luck out there. But with glasses. But yeah, she looked like a failed Disney Channel host star. Like, it, no one liked her anymore, so they just, like, dropped her. <laughs> and then she just decided to make videos. I know that's not really what happened, but, like, how she became a YouTuber. But, like, pretty funny. Hyperwolf like, has to. She had, she did a, like a on like a, like a role playing sex thing on GTA Five. Really? That's weird. I mean, if if that doesn't give you bad, I don't know what does. <laughs> yeah, so we're doing like we're just talking to everybody and then try to do all this the side quest stuff that they have for us. Hello, Scott. Welcome back to Sam Mood. I've adjusted my connection to your implant. The headache you experienced before shouldn't reoccur. Yeah, what was that about? You said we need to discuss something confidential. You should know certain facts before you leave on your expedition. It seemed best we speak alone. 
Why the secrecy? I don't understand the need for secrecy. Your father felt it was for the best. What was he trying to hide? My true capabilities. Alec overrode the implant safety protocols. It allows for unrestricted access to the pathway's physiology. People. And that's and lesbian. me. Oh, really? Oh. And only you. I can act as a force multiplier. I mean, I can see that. Like, enhancing your to be honest, who cares if you're a lesbian? Alec called them profiles. They provide unique tactical augmentation during combat. Your father preferred to keep this fact to himself. I can understand. People might get the wrong idea. Super soldiers. A computer having control over a human. Providing an enhancement to the human. It is a symbiotic relationship that benefits both. What do you get out of it? Though I'm artificial in design, I am fully sentient. Far beyond what even the initiative understands. I don't follow. You're an AI. So what's different? I am a new form of AI, drawing directly from the human experience. Your implant is my window into the world. Will it hurt? Okay. Well, just so long as it doesn't hurt. The only pain is that which life provides. As I've discovered, this can be a lesson in itself. It's one I'd rather avoid. So, where do we go from here? I find myself in an unusual. Was Ryder smoking so weed? You guys saw his his his, his, uh, his eyes. They were kind of reddish. I think he was smoking well, weed. He placed a block on portions of my memory array. He probably took like an edible before Why? he. he Perhaps so. Talking. When you asked me what his plan was, I wouldn't know. And Dad strikes again, but not without recourse. The further you father. explore as a pathfinder, the more oh, you are removed. Perhaps you should begin in your father's quarters. In kind of weird taking over my own father's fucking quarters. To be honest. I mean, that's where he probably jerks off to shits. You know, like oh, this toy is still smells like dad's ass cheeks. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and then Cora comes in. And she's like, "Hey, Ryder, I got the report." And then she just saw me just sniff, like seeing Ryder just sniffing the toilet seat. He's like, "It reminds me of my dad." And he, and he has like a mental breakdown. And Cora's like, "God damn it, Ryder!" Now he's having another mental breakdown. Wait, I can like. Can I actually change? No, I Maybe I can unlock it. Actually. Oh, these are different. No, it's a. Me six. Vanguard. I'm just an ad that's right now. Oh yeah, I did load it up, right? Right. Right. Hey. Hey, Peter. Hey, Pay. Hey, Peter. Omni grenade. Barricade. Blaze temporary uh, energy. Barricades that will boost shield regeneration. Cover behind it. Ooh, that could be. Ooh. My own cover? Hell yeah, baby. That's actually pretty fucking cool. Um, let's try combat. Uh, power damage, melee. Combat fitness. Confirmed. Alright. Uh, save the game. Yes, sir. Go to your ship. Speak with Sam. Okay, I gotta go to uh, another planet to receive a dead body because I'm trying to investigate a murder case. Because, you know. I still gotta investigate security footage. Oh, yeah, I was just exploring. I never went to this side, right? I don't think you can open this side. No, you cannot. By the way, guys, we are. Should, should I play Fort? I don't know why I want to play Fort. Now we'll play Halo Three. Tonight. I mean, dude, we're already like at the arc of Halo Three <laughs> in in the first let's play already. I think we had like four to five hours into Halo. I mean, Halo Five. I mean, five Halo Three, and um, too many Halos, and um, like we're already at the arc. So. Yeah, 
we, we might actually finish Halo 2. I mean, Halo 3 in two more streams. To be honest. Because the game isn't that hard when you play on Legendary mode. I expect it to be a lot harder for some reason because it's Halo 3. But honestly, I think Halo 2 is a little bit harder than Halo 3 is. In my opinion. This file is useless. Let's check another. Yeah, Halo 3 is pretty easy though. It's just like you just die a lot quicker. And another scrambled file. Coincidence seems unlikely. Let's check another. This file is also corrupted. Definitely not a coincidence. You'd need pretty high clearance to mess with the security camera files. Someone working for Candros, maybe. That is the most probable scenario. Think you can get enough out of the files to find a match using biometric scans, Sam? The files were badly scrambled. But if I combine all the available identifiers, it might work. I'm an AI in my brain, brothers. Isn't that cool? We are looking for a human male, assigned either to the Nexus or Hyperion. You will need to conduct scans from close proximity. Got it. Oh yeah, we gotta finish Dragon Age Inquisition. I forgot about that game. Oh, it's that one game that because we completed. Uh, I completed. Uh, Dragon... I might just redo Dragon Age. To be honest. Like I was streaming it, and then I it was actually giving me like a lot of uh, viewers at one point. But I might Hello. just actually. Just... I'm Gian Garson, founder yeah. of the initiative. It's through your hard work that the vision of the Nexus has come to life. You and all your colleagues bind our proud new colonies together. Look around at your achievements, <laughs> and if you have any questions, my door is always open. Founder Garson's office is located at workspace not allocated. Please select a topic. Welcome back, Scott Ryder. Please select a topic. Gosh, I didn't repeat what she said earlier. For initiative strategy and pathfinder coordination, please see Director Jaron Tan. For colonial affairs or outpost status, please see Director Foster Addison. For station maintenance, please contact Superintendent Nakmore Kesh. For militia operations or Apex deployment, please see Tiran Kandros. Integration from the Hyperion is ongoing. Personnel are still restricted to operations. You are Scott Ryder, salary code 19B, active Pathfinder. Oh, my name is Your Scott. Your supervisor is <laughs> Director Tan. Based on current staffing needs, you will be eligible for paid vacation time in 587 days. Seriously? Why not plan on which <laughs> beautiful colony you'll vacation on while you wait? Seriously? Viable planets capable of supporting life are key to our survival in Andromeda. The viability of a world is affected by several factors, including temperature, resources, threat levels, political stability, and so on. We have few viable planets currently within range. Resource levels are considered at risk. The selection process saw the Andromeda Initiative evaluate thousands of potential habitable planets within the galaxy. After discovering an unusually high ratio of potential candidates for Golden Worlds, the Helios Cluster was selected as our destination. Even at a distance, studying the light from stars can reveal much about their planet's composition and atmosphere. Seven worlds, nicknamed Habitats, have the life-supporting environments and resources we need to start our new lives in Andromeda. Fuck off, bitch. Do I have to scan something? Oh, it's telling me going underneath, I think. Oh, no, never mind. No, oh, wait. Yeah, we gotta go down here. No news on the Turian arc yet. Or is this militia business? Oh, I can't tell him what happened. Bye, Kandros. Oh, it's the guard. 
exit march. Hey, Kale, what's up? Uh, what's up? Uh, hey, how's, how's it going? I'm only here for the for a message since everyone decided to stream now. So have a lucky ooh woo. -woo. Well, thank you, Kaleism, or Uwu Kaleism. I appreciate that a lot. You're too nice and supportive. I do appreciate your uh, support. You're, you're such a great person. What the fuck? Who the hell do I scan next? The game's like, oh, you need to scan me. I'm like, what? Yeah, so this is the first time I ever played a trauma, though. No, sh no bullshit. So I never in this game. I never played it, and I never watched any videos besides Video Game Donkey because that that was really funny when he made fun of this game. But yeah, hopefully your day is going great, uh, Kellyism. What the hell? What the fuck do I do? What the fuck do I do? What, dude? This this fucking bro. Disneyland Adventure, dude. Bo <laughs> a bomb. <laughs> right, I guess we're gonna go. Yeah. Oh wait, do I have to pick where I have to go? God damn it! Hey, Hailism, have you ever played a trauma before? Because I, you know, <laughs> it's a, it's a pip boy. Basic, a pip. I know it's army to war, right, but I call it a pip boy. Negative match. Is it him? Hey, Peter, you're under arrest, Peter. He's like, what? Because I'm trying to find this. Scan results show a partial positive. Target is most likely suspect. Dale Atkins, right? Dale Dickens. We need to talk. Look, not to be rude, but I have work to do. Is that what you call it? Is that what sabotage is called these days? work <laughs> you're pretty arrogant for the new kid you don't even know what's been going on proof says you've been up to no good figures screw this screw all you hypocrites on this station you weren't here when they kicked out our loved ones mutiny we just wanted answers my sister is out there i don't even know if she's alive or so you've decided to sabotage the ship that you're on dude how fucking dumb are you this guy is so retarded you guys can we have an L in the chat for this for, for this fucking idiot? This guy is so dumb. I'm sorry for what happened, but setting explosives isn't the answer. Neither was sending people into exile because they didn't agree with policy. <sighs> I don't care what you think. The mutiny leaders were right to demand to know what was going on. You could have hurt people, killed them. Like those who got killed when the leadership had the Krogan stop. Oh, boo hoo! I'm done. Boo hoo! It was me. Aw, oh, boo hoo! You need to go. Um, not up to me, bub. Not my call. The Nexus leaders will make that decision. That lot make a decision. That'll be the day. Man, what a pussy bitch. Yeah, we found the fucking culprit, and then it turns out it was a pussy bitch. Alright, so... Um, journal. <gasps> oh, Jesus! These are missions. Oh, uh, these are loyalty missions. Those are. Uh, these missions are critical to the uh, survival of Helios. Um, mission com completed missions, tasks, and activities. These goals may not be central to the uh, survival, but helps. Right, this place depends on Helios. I'm glad you can mark, like, um, I'm glad you can mark your uh, 
your side quest mission, so it's less fucking confusing. I like that a lot. Hey, should I romance Kara? I know you could romance her. Ready to see what Tan gave us? Should I romance I hear her? It's something just... special. I mean, she is kind of cute. Route. I just don't That's like her shit. haircut. <laughs> and final checks looking I don't mind if she had a like uh, like, we won't like uh, a ponytail or a bun, going, but we'll be on our you know, own out here. It is. In other words, we're making this up as we go. <laughs> we used to call that tactical improvisation, but at least we'll be doing it in style. True. Ooh. Is that a penis ship? Call her the Tempest. More like the penis. <laughs> no, okay. Hey, it may me not be the uh Aw. Even though it's not the Normandy guys. But it is what it is, right folks? It is a penis! Dude, this shaped like a penis! Yo, my ship is shaped like a penis? Yo, this game is a W. I love it. It's a penis shaped ship, dude. There's no fucking way. That's a penis take a ship. Closer look. It's a dick ship. That's hilarious. Let's pick it up a bit, people. We're 14 months late. 14 months late? <laughs> so you're the one who's making everything happen. Hey, you may not Petra, be Garrus, but. Veteran X. You know, Initiative it's fun. Wrangler, Provisioner, Gunner, and everything in between. Even Are a sex ready? person. The sooner we get out of here, the better. You're coming with us? Yes. Otherwise, like there's no way they're letting the ship off the station. Get out of here. Yeah. Let's go see the rest of Helios. I know you can run that area as well. You're not going anywhere. Damn it. I didn't do it. Whatever happened, it wasn't me. I just got here. Director Addison wants to see a complete report of the Tempest supplies, munitions, and crew. Director Tan overruled Addison. The ship's loaded out with equipment for outpost discovery, squarely under Director Addison's purview. Senior around Ben, right? Yeah, flirt with him. She gonna suck his dick. Came here with a family, didn't you? Son still in cryo? I could pull some strings, get him to the front of the line. Really? Yeah, really. They told me he wasn't essential, but I miss him. Oh. I know. I got family too, Ben. It's done. <sighs> Addison's gonna kill me. Nicely done. Part of the job, Pathfinder. All things considered, it was an easy ask. I don't know right what now, you need it, people tearing down you, uh, obstacles, not putting up more. You get you different. Wait, what? You? I don't know what you did, but you, you definitely did. Stuff and not just talking about it. What, what do you mean? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I'm confused. What I said earlier. Don't we? Every I'm gonna be honest. Ninety-five percent of every time I talk on the stream, I have no idea what the fuck I'm talking about. Lesser crew, of course. I do apologize. Glad to see you're doing so well, Scott. I right, finally we have our ship. The engine core is it's a penis ship, boys. Drive. It but runs a hell of a lot quieter. That's Gil Brody, engineer, mechanic, all around wrench jockey. We call this the research room. There's space for upgrading equipment, gathering intel. Router engaged. Securing connection to Tempest. Welcome aboard, Sam. And Ryder, of course. All run by Suvi Anwar, our science officer. Your quarters are below. Plenty of space up here to get everyone together. It's all yours. She's light, stealthy, and the fastest ship in her class. Um. <sighs> it's really going to be something, isn't it? I haven't even shown you the best part. Your, your, your when you're ready to fly, I know post over to the bridge. Our pilot should have everything good to go. I'm gonna miss Joker though. Joker was the best pilot. No one could beat Joker. Head to the bridge when we're ready to go. I'm ready to go. We talked to everybody. You can make mid calls 
from the central table or just get the crew together. Oh, nice. Uh, to the bridge! Do -do 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 -do. The research room. You can Last run one. research projects Check and coordinate toy. with the Nexus from here. Seems like we're forever racing. But there's always time to check out new toys. Useful ones. Well, you have, well, you have a flashlight? For new toys. I think they have flashlights in this, in this game. Like anything you grab from Habitat 7. Raw minerals, tech, doesn't matter. The research station will strip that stuff down, give you options. Um. Explore, explorers tuned skeptics? I'll take any advantage I can get, even if it's exploring junk. Hey, with tech like this, it won't be junk for long. Not after True. work, too. I have a feeling uh, of yeah, being a scavenger is actually top tier because uh, you probably can make really good weapons and shit. So I have a feeling it's a lot better to be a scavenger. I didn't pick that. I picked biotic because it sounds fun. I mean, it's always dude. Biotic is always good in all Mass Effect games. Like it's always like it helps you out. It's it's it, like that's why you always bring Liara definitely from big suicide missions and shit like that or big fights because like she could like make she could make a black hole where everyone could get sucked into and all that shit. Like she's a like she's a really good companion to have, which is insane. Select research to unlock a new blueprints and uh, arrangements by spending research data. Um, development or research, development or development or development or dude, this is fucking hard. I scroll down and all I can see is for like like YouTube lot YouTube Shorts lives. Like all I can see is fucking uh, what was it? All I can see is like um uh webcam girls. I'm like what? Ah, uh, research sounds boring. So let's go with development. Ooh. Can I uh? Oh, I could craft it. Instead of, instead of saying the M7 is M8. Because <laughs> they're different weapons. Okay, I get it. So I guess in the M7 weapons are supposed to be god top tier because they're like top elite. Can I get this gun? Oh, we, okay, so. Looks like they kind of kept every gun, but just renamed it. And then they just added new ones. Actually. Oh yeah, this is crafted. Um, I guess we got a new pistol. Oh yeah, we helmets and stuff. Oh, we got a skirmisher helmet. Um. I'm I'm learning how to do this shit. Intel. Oh, I need a I need that much iron and titanium and all that shit. Okay. So I had to craft my armor. That's cool. So if I actually want the N7 armor, I got, it's called Pathfinder armor, but it has the N7 armor on it as well. So if I want it, I have to craft it myself. But that's, I think that's fine. Makes sense. But that's really cool though. Damn, look at these fucking things. Holy shit! That's new. Sandstorm assault rifle. That looks fucking badass. That look oh, they actually have fucking revolvers in this game now. That's sick. That's sick. Man, I wish they had revolvers in Mass Effect 3. Imagine seeing Commander Shepard rocking with a revolver, bro. Dude, that would have been cool. I'm Commander Shepard. Well, bang, okay. We're like, ah! Okay, okay, I'm, I'm setting here. I have finished bullying everyone wait wait what are you talking about <laughs> what you're a bully what the hell kaleism are you crazy are you out of your mind
Oh yeah, this is the multiplayer stuff. Should we try the multiplayer game? No, but fuck it. Let's, let's try out multiplayer. I never knew this game had multiplayer until like I, like recent, like five, ten minutes, thirty minutes ago. I already missed, missed the version of Mass Effect. Um, I guess we could do that. Um, do that one. Why not? Let's just join. See if anyone's playing this game in 2023. I mean, for 2023. <laughs> Imagine that. Hey, we, all right, we got in the match. seconds like oh he, he he's doing black oh god Oh, it's like a fucking, uh, it's basically like fire. Teammate injured. 
No, I'm not. I just fell and now I gotta take a shit. It looks like I'm dead already. Gracias. Enemy fire. Careful. Cover. Yeah, it's not that great. I think Mass Effect 3 covers that thing. Hey, the mo the mobility. Taking cover is pretty cool. I'm coming, Elizabeth! Mission complete. All teams secure. Yeah, yeah. Good work. I just started. I just joined it. And we've already done it. I didn't know it would be a firefight. I thought it would be like a PvP game for a minute. And I was like, wait, they added PvP in this game? What the fuck? And then, you know. <laughs> I was like, alright, cool. I'll try it out, but I didn't expect it to be a firefight. Damn, look at the level up. I just joined. <laughs> Um. Oh yeah, we could customize our, or choose a character. Oh, we could play as a female soldier instead. Seven, eight. Let me see eight, seven, eight. What the fuck am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh god. I mean she looks cool. Let's we pick her. Play as her. I still think for Mass Effect 4, they should let us I think what the biggest downfall about I think the biggest thing that I don't like is that you can't cut you can't you're forced to be a human no matter what in the story and i kind of wish for a trauma i think it was a massive miss by the way for them. that they should have let you like you don't have to be a human like why can't we be like a uh why can't we be, be like a blue bitch or, or like um uh, and, and then instead of like our dad it could be our like our hot mom or some shit or <laughs> in the game by the way <laughs> or like uh you know like because they're only it's only female so like i can understand or they could have like a, like a human uh, dad because like because they could but like, it would have been cool to play as like a, a Krogan, you know what I mean? You know, how, dude, I would definitely play as a Krogan if, if they had that customization that you could, oh, you could play as a Krogan now. I'd be like, fuck yeah, I want to be a Krogan. I want to be a badass. I would make my Krogan the tankiest motherfucker in the game. 110%. Or look at this, like the armor is so cool. And like, it's, it's like, why not? Or, or a Salarian, dude. Or, or not Salarian. Is this a Salarian? I think so. Or if we could be Salarians. That would have been cool. A family of Salarians, and then you could be a badass, skinny, uh, twig boy. That would be cool. And then, like, whoever, like, interact with you will give you different response because of your race. That would have been a lot cooler, dude. 100% that would have been super duper cool. But no. 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 Mmm. That's pretty uh, let's be this do one again. Cause I just joined that one. So uh, do it. How the fuck do I do it? Oh. Um. Oh, difficulty. Let's do gold. Yeah, fuck. Let's do platinum. Let's, let's do hard. I'm hard. Hard as a fucking rock, baby. I am very spread. Do more damage when you use the school. There's no game. Ooh, I look like a Doom guy. <laughs> the coloring looks like Doom guy. What the fuck? That's awesome. Oh shit! I'm gonna spoil. I got
Jump over, you fucking dude. Was I bugging? Failed. Shit. Fuck me, right? I rescue my teammate and we end up dying. <laughs> Lost connection. I wonder if they I wonder why. I'm pretty sure the guy who hosting that or hosting that game probably Man, what the fuck? I didn't see this. Look, it has to like load all these fucking shaders, dude. <laughs> oh my god. But well, I hope everyone's having a good day or a decent day. Actually, have you guys looked at the solar eclipse and went blind yet or no? I didn't even give a fuck. I always streamed the entire time. I was like, oh yeah, the solar eclipse is happening. I'm like gaming, playing Halo. <laughs> I'm like, fuck that. I know that it comes, it, it goes, it comes. I mean, the eclipse happened, what, every hundred million thousand years or whatever the fuck, right? <laughs> but fuck that. I got Halo 3 to play, bro. <laughs> I'm like, fuck that. Why, why would I want to see a moon blocking the sun? You know? <laughs> It's whatever. I, I thought it was very funny how a lot of people thought it was going to be the end of the world. Like, it's the end times! Or, like, or the rapture is going to happen. Like, when, um, if you're, you know, you know, the rapture from the Bible. But none of it fucking happened. Like, dude, it's just a moon covering the sun. It's nothing crazy. It's cool, but it's nothing crazy. <laughs> and now we have, like, a, like a, like a star is ready to explode pretty soon or some shit around 2028, I guess. And like it, it's it that shit rarely happens, I guess. Like every like million years or some bullshit. But apparently, uh, some star or some somewhere in the in the galaxy is gonna explode. Like this weird rupture thing. I don't know. It's weird. Space space is really fucking weird. It doesn't make any sense. It's just like hey, space. <laughs> space is so weird. It's like the weirdest thing for humanity. Even oceans, oceans and space is. Like, like, holy fuck, man. Nuts. If you think about it, like, the world is a little weird. Everything's weird. Everything's not normal. Like, 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 it's just weird. If you really think about it, it's really weird. Wop wop! My boy! My boy! <laughs> my boy! And he's like, why the fuck is he crying? <laughs> oh, what's up, Wop? How's it going today, man? I look like that one guy, that one skinny actor. He was in Parks and Rec. Give me toilet. I would admit it was very creepy. Departure trajectory locked. Nexus control. Ah, time for introductions. But it feels you like must be Ryder. something rare. A pleasure to be here and to meet you, of course. I'll be piloting. But yeah, because it is 2024, so like a lot of crazy shit. But it'll take a Pathfinder's guidance to see us. Because it's been like over like. I mean, we're, technically, we're in the future. Because in the past, everyone, they're like, oh, this is going to happen. Uh, we might have this, you know, more pollution. And, it, you know, it's happening. Like, the weather is really, it, the pollution and all that shit. The weather is, I mean, my, like, like the uh, global warming is really weird right now. Because, like, you know, like, the ice are melting and all the water is rising up. So, like, you know, it's starting to flood a lot more. So, like, we're getting more water than usual. Because the, uh. The uh, or the uh, Atlantic, or like the uh, like uh, yeah, like the Atlantic, uh, not Atlantic. Uh, fuck, what was it? I think it was like the South or North or whatever was starting to melt. Like glaciers are melting, you know, more and you know, like species are dying because of it. 
and then you know it's gonna be weird it's gonna be even more crazy in the year like in the next 50 years from now or in the next 10 years to think about because like who knows what's gonna happen <laughs> like it's, it's crazy man it's crazy plenty of dangers out there Nature is do doing nature. Yeah, nature is just being nature. Mother Nature is doing her thing, you know. She's just, she's just uh, cloud. enjoying life. I was test pilot for the Tempest's early prototypes. I admit, I'm itching to see how she performs. I always consider uh, when it's windy. I always consider it's Mother Nature's farts because, like, you know, you know how far it's like it blows. So away. how do I? I always the figure like Mother Nature has just swipe, like, windy, touch a destination like, here, like, and oh, the nav they, system they, calculates everything. Shit, you know, very efficient. <laughs> It was optimized for a Pathfinder. Everything's secure, if you're ready. Is anyone ready for something this big? We signed on for the big stuff when we came to Andromeda. All right. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. Command access is transferring successfully. Uh, science and monitoring stations yeah, are got that fucking, uh, Lexi's Final Fantasy hair, dude, dude. Helm is green. Gil reports the drive core is online. This song. is it, Ryder. The Tempest is <laughs> yours. Hey, hey, Unless hey, you yeah. got something to say for the log. Um. I never planned to be Pathfinder. I don't know what's out there. But we're the Milky Way's best and brightest. We can do this. Why would you say that about the Nexus wind control. as this is I'm the enjoying Tempest. it? I didn't too far. <laughs> well, I think because, you know, nature is alive. You know what I mean? So it's like, you know, like, since we're alive, we fart, we release gas too. So it makes sense if nature, when it's windy, it's just a giant fart from nature itself. But in the good way, though, in a good way, you know, in a healthy Departure way. Departure vector verified, Tempest. Hey, look at our penis ship, by God the way. It's a penis-sized ship. Isn't that cool? I love it. Hey, Bader. Hey, ba hey, hey, Bader. Hey. Hey, Bader. We're, Eos, we're, we're Pathfinders. Bader. Been our habitat one. Hey, Bader. So outpost puts an end to the idea. Maybe we can turn things around. Callow, take us in. Hey. If Joe was in, in the fucking uh, Fortnite, I would definitely buy him. <laughs> If they made him out of that cripple, uh, Megatron thing from the old, uh, Family System Guy, but make, min Andromeda make him smaller and just make him look one. like a, uh, Designated like a, uh, like a human size, I think it would be first Or get his wheelchair, Until like, no legs and arms. Or just his arms twice. shooting. <laughs> Why has Sam altered frequency detection? What are we hearing, Sam? There is a signal, Pathfinder. I recommend an immediate examination of EOS. Oh shit, I select something else. Oh no, I didn't select where I wanted to go! No! Now we gotta watch this shit! <laughs> Fuck! Oh my god! Well, since we're here, I guess we, we do this mission here then. <laughs> Son of a bitch. What the hell am I doing? Anomaly detected. Let's actually go. Yeah, a lot of fun slash creepy stuff. They should do it now. A mirror of the signal on Habitat 7. Possible atmospheric manipulation. Is that possible? F E. Well, if it is like Habitat Seven, no doubt we'll run into the cat. I'm picking up something. Hey, how do you launch nodes? Robes. What a do. Oh, there we go. Um, oh, cool. 
I'm the predator. Oh my, oh my. Oh my, oh my. Oh my. I wanna try that one. I wanna try that one. I guess we have one. That's fucking great. <laughs> Do I have a snipey? I do now. Ah oh, shit. I wanna be a sniper expert. Ooh, I can change whatever armor I want. That's nice. I could look awesome. I like him when he wears his helmet. I think he looks cooler. I think without it, he just looks like a... Aw. Just keep your helmet on, dude. <laughs> if Muffin played the uh, record room, he would be saying racial slurs at little kids. No, I'll probably just say fucking shit a lot. That's it. <laughs> That's really it. Suiting up. Ready, Freddy. Hope we're all that ready. Oh, boy, Gallo. kids. All right. Ooh. Integrating search area from Sam. How he pulled that mystery signal through the storms, I have no idea. Multi-sensory neural collation. Amazing. Factory fresh across the board. Spinning up the compensators. You're already tuning the displays. We'll get a better read on this pass than the Nexus has had in months. He doesn't like the sun. He's like me. More wider. What? I said a lot of people have their hopes pinned on us. They gave up on Eos. I can't blame them. Expected a golden world, instead they saw their friends die. Never know how that'll affect. Oh. Sorry. You okay? I think I'm still messed up by what happened with my dad. There hasn't been much time to process it. Oh, no, he's begging. No. I don't beg. I mean, Unless I think I'm still bedroom. feeling it. <laughs> like, <laughs> hearing things. Other than Pathfinder, the Tempest checks out. We're good. Meant to say sure. Take us down. You have no idea how long I've wanted a Pathfinder to say that. No, no. <laughs> Core is hot. Shields holding, adjusting entry. We got this. Right? There. Set us down at this nav point. Me, my hand. Where am I a titan? Having sex with the birds and the eagles. Hot, hot, hot. Oh, what's up, sniper killer? I didn't even know you're still in the chat. <laughs> Thank you, love. Yeah, I hope everyone's having the scrumptious day today. Play Mass Effect and um, yeah, I never really played this. How to even starve? So his muffin looks away. Storm chat. <laughs> yeah. Chat, be nice. Y'all be, y'all behave, okay? I know, I, I know, I know. Womp, womp. Looks it's, like it's just a little psychopath, Ooh. but Days it's okay, brothers. Who else is Brother. here? We. They must have known these were the Wee, I see my, my fucking ultra ego they of fucking uh, war. They do not. Ultra ego. We'll make Eos home. That's weird. Whatever, sniper <laughs> killer. What was wrong? Doors getting emergency power, but it's code locked. Site one. You're lucky, you guys. I like you guys. Or I I wouldn't. Outpost self organizes and sets its own protocol. And you guys don't want me to. Just say we can't open it without codes. I can probably get like a Saint Yes and shit. Like, yes, shit yourself! Shit yourself! I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> what a shit myself. Shitting myself is bad. Ooh, I 
Data pad. Data pad. Gives us access if we need it. We suffered our first death today. Storm came out of nowhere. Shit. Lockley tried to cover us cops. <sighs> Dude, I don't. I didn't know women's shit. Got swept away. I thought they all. Oh, I quiet. thought they just queef and that's it. Maybe by the time they wake her up, I'll know what to say. That's him, my favorite streamer. Oh wait, I'm your favorite streamer. Or who? Who is your favorite streamer? Unless you're, or unless you're just telling me that I'm a piece of shit streamer, then your answer is yes. <laughs> Uh, I think I gotta take a shit. Should I shit on stream, guys? Should I take you guys to my bathroom and you guys can look at my TV? I'll tell you stories about me shitting. <laughs> I could get a joke without actually. Unless it's on pick, that's fine. I could show my asshole and my cock. Main door had power, but not the interior doors. Full functionality would require going, an active power going to edge. station. Damn, dude, don't yeah, edge too hard, Wamp Pump, like, like you did yesterday, because you were saying weird, like crazy shit. Thing. Even Grim was like, "Holy shit, dude!" <laughs> we all been there. <laughs> Even Grim was like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> Guy, YouTube channel name is Muffin. It's it's actually Immortal. I got a partial log, but I can't turn on the antenna. Something's bl blocking the power. Sand a remote lock. I guess it's radiation. Is active. The interference originates nah, I'm from a nearby right power now. relay. The tower. Have looked great back in the Milky Way. We're not the only ones interested in what happened here. Let's check out this relay tower. case to stay positive. Put on a brave face for the rest of the team. But I can't shake the feeling that I'm going to die out here. How do you scan again? This analysis provides us with important research data, Pathfinder. If you continue to scan and collect, can you believe this game is supposed to be six hundred and thirty-six years for equipment such as your weapons after and armor. Mass Effect Three? As to to me, I think that's a little bit too far for the future. I, I expect maybe like around a hundred years, like, like you know, like a next generation after Shepard. But no, it was like beyond that. <laughs> He's an ancestor to these guys now. Like holy fuck, that's. Let's just keep our scanner out so we can see. Hello? What is it? Fucking Friday the 13th? Not Friday the 13th. Uh, Five Nights at Freddy's? Friday. <laughs> uh, I actually played that game. I think I own it on my PlayStation 4. It's actually funny. But it's fun, but like, I haven't played it for a while. Edging so hard. Bruh, it's you. <laughs> it's not forget it's like, bruh. <laughs> like, dude. I'm talking about you. Well, thank you, Sniper Killer. I, do. <laughs> I know I'll, I could be like a like a like a goofy duck bird, but like, <laughs> why the fuck do I get it? Can we get up? Can we go inside? All right. I hit G, but it didn't act. Is F? Is it H? Yeah, H is like. The menu for some reason. And geez. Look at this place. It's a waste. We. The radiation in Eos's atmosphere makes it difficult to cultivate. I have three life. minutes and come back. Radiation. To this. What the Our fuck? Our suits protect against that, right? <laughs> Site one contains shield masks. To a wampa is getting high as as do donkey shit. Right he's he's being he get highest draft. Not be advised. Okay. This I'm just talking about pooping and then like uh uh Wampa was talking about Sam? It fits like, the profile of a power relay station pathfinder. Hyper killer uses. Right. We get it running? It's inoperable pathfinder. It's like assassin creed. Maybe. Long in this environment without power. We didn't expect this kind of environment. Who could? Who could? Huh. Guess that shit wasn't kept then. That shit wasn't they don't what? knock? There are people here? We thought everyone left was gone. He love Edge. Of course I love Edge too, man. Now shove off. Find your own salvage. This spot's taken. I'm here to help, you dumb fuck. I'm not a salvager. I'm a pathfinder. We've come to fix all this. Call me Clancy. Pathfinder, huh? Like that changes much. The Nexus just can't let Eos go, can it? 
however much it fails down here. I'm tracking a signal that will help EOS. I only need power for the antenna. Look, I cut the power for a reason. The Ket are patrolling today. You turn the power relay back on, they'll yeah. know there's a juicy yeah. target alive down here. Uh, my YouTube keep breaking. <laughs> Do you just have an aneurysm on the chat? Uh, Kalism? Because what you said in the end, it was confusing. I thought it was a YouTuber name, but I couldn't tell what it was. I'm gonna have to skip today. Skip what? Open? You don't want to skip open. Help me with the power relay, and I'll take care of it. I was like, ah, oh, edging. Ah, oh, edging. Well, maybe it's a good crazy. Okay. He's, I can picture I'll him doing the this. Generators out there. I, I you picture the tiger. Oh, it's on you. Oh, it's right here. I picture, I picture, uh, I picture Wompop is doing this. Here, I'll show you. This is what's popping into my brain when, he, when, when he's talking about edging hard. Yes, YouTube is killing me. Then it's all of us. I picture wearing more. I need more. <laughs> edging. So good. <laughs> That's what I picture, uh, like fucking, um, Mm -hmm, yes, Master. Mm -hmm, edging. <laughs> Fucking womp womp, dude. Why you YouTube die, woo woo? Womp's breaking it. Yeah, womp womp is just being weird. Sorry, ladies. Uh, womp womp is being, you know, womp womp is just being weird. My lady. My lady. All right. That's not like that hurt. Yes. There's an error in the startup sequence. Manual input required. You see me riding Please and driving one of the up on that pole. See, you see me and you already know I want to fuck you. Fuck you. You already know I want to fuck you. Fuck you. You already know. Up on breaking it. No, uh. Wait, can you guys see anything? <laughs> that was so impossible for a bit. I was like, ah, shit. They see me riding, they see me riding and grinding up on the pole. They see me and you are I'm pretty sure I'm skipping alert. What, like a certain alert. Because I can't. Up on the pole. Oh, good. No. Oh. Oh, fuck. Oh, I gotta go up there and eat. Fucking do things. All right. Eat. All right. Here we go, baby. Bait it. I'm a repair man. I'm a repair scavenger man. Generator is active. Sam, my friend Clancy, was he part of the outpost team here? No, Pathfinder. According to Nexus records, he's stationed in the hut. My bay. penis shit. So he's what? Playing hooky? Really, Ryder? I shit me. It's like, what the fuck is rocking on top? Of oh, is it? Oh, is this? Uh oh, it looks small from the outside. To be honest, it doesn't look as big. It's so wide, but but it's, it's a lot of. Let's right, repair that one. Now. Al, your girlfriend? In the game or in real life? Who the fuck is Al? We've got company. Or AI. I don't have an AI girlfriend. In the game, I'm single in the game. But you could romance me. Finally! Finally! Killing! Oh my god, no more talking about boring shit. Because I don't give a fuck. I just want to kill things. No, that sounds so psychopathic. Yeet. Reload. It. Damn, they have high. I'm gonna fuck them. Oh, 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 oh. Ah, shit! He's shooting me. Oh no! It was a rock blocking it. I thought. It, I, oh. Oh my god. 
Yeah, I'm shooting right through it. I don't know how I'm doing that, but it's the future, baby. The power relay station is ready for activation, Pathfinder. I'm just ready. Bro, my girl, my character said he's a drug dealer. He's <laughs> Yo, that's the best. Uh, that's the best. Drug best drug dealer in the galaxy. He's got a shit at me. He was a stand. You took down all those cat. Sure, use the power relay. Hell, take whatever you like. Word of advice, though, if that signal of yours is out past the perimeter, you'll need a ride. A ride? Shuttles aren't fun in these winds. You need wheels. I think they kept a little something in storage. You didn't take it. Didn't get around to salvaging it yet. I tried. It ain't that simple. Might be easier for a pathfinder, though. We're heading to our shuttle. Keep this up. Maybe next time we'll find more than just salvage around here. Don't suppose you've got anything we can use? Oh, shit. <laughs> Wait. What happened? No! I bought something. Oh, what the? What did I buy? Did I buy, like, frisbee? Or oh, no. I actually... Dude. Oh, dude, I wasted 2,000 credits. Are you fucking kidding me? Or even 10,000. That's even worse. I don't think I had 10,000. That's a lot. I think I had like like 1,000. But oh, god damn it. Oh. No, it, oh, son of a bitch. I could have just fucking bought a new weapon, dude. I could have bought a weapon. Oh, my fucking dick is on fire now. Two thousand. Shut up, Womp. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna get out. Fuck, I guess. I'm so bad. Fucking kidding me, dude. I just got fucked. Correct. Plus, I've located the source of the signal no, detected robot, in orbit. Correct. It's coming from the large alien structure just beyond Site 1. The structure appears almost identical to the one your father used to adjust the atmosphere on the previous planet. It's worth investigation. That almost feels like a lead. Damn right it's worth investigating. Here, <laughs> here. A warning. Radiation levels beyond the perimeter of Site 1 are well above acceptable limits. You cannot proceed without additional protection. I no reason to see if that alien's. Well, I'm wearing my armor. Come on, we better find that vehicle Clancy mentioned. Now the power is restored, we can investigate the nearby buildings. Now we gotta go on foot uh, to save the game because I don't want to fucking reload everything. Nah. Oh. Hello, everyone. Uh, Mass Effect Atromina. We're playing basically the fifth game. Uh, Ma Mass Effect 4 isn't out yet, so they skipped the game because there's some progress, so they released Atromina instead. So now we're playing it. So, f so 5 came out before 4 did, so that's pretty interesting. There any drugs in there? My bad. Oh, I gotta find this fucking truck thing, right? It's over there. For some reason, the game looks better in pictures. But when we play the game, it looks it looks okay. It doesn't look that great. I think the characters' models are kind of kind of like squishy. If that makes sense. I'm guilt. But like, I don't know. Man. Something about it is weird. This game doesn't. Special oh. requisition: all-terrain scout rover, a nomad, six-wheel drive, jump jets, just what you need. I might be drooling a little bit. 
This Finger. must be what Clancy Arden. meant. The crate requires an access code from a forward station. Forward stations act as emergency lie, resupply I checkpoints. Several are currently in orbit. Right. I can call. Fuck. One down. Let's find a good spot. No good. The forward station should have the access code once we call it down. Ah, oh, great. I got a dick around. Activating automated forward station deployment. Aw, oh, I can't go in it. I want to get like, see if I can buy it. But it wouldn't let me go in it. Game ruined my phone. Looks like the forward station supplies. Why would I need this again? You're intact. Downloading Nomad Crate access code. Oh, I think it was just. I recorded the demon explain like his algorithm. I don't know who I don't even know who Al is. Oh, it's in there. Fuck me. Oh, they're jumping around. That's what the noise was about. Well, what do you know? The outpost research center is still intact. Updating the Tempest on this critical recovery. Research was always key to the initiative. We'll need it here too. We're not scavenging anymore. This is how we rebuild. Someone else agrees. This research center was used recently to monitor the alien signal. This gives us the tools to find the source. And maybe whoever else is looking. Hanging up fucking like drugs. Hmm. Oh. The research station is back online. I've provided a list of no. weapons we can build. I know it has more, but I don't care. Required components. I'm just here for the gameplay. Hello, baby. I actually look pretty dope. I didn't then know. Got it, baby. Save the game. And now let's. Ooh. No man should handle pretty smooth. Check both forward and reverse, would you? Radiation! Like ball ah, out. Can't get traction. It's too steep. Switch to six wheel drive. It'll get you up there in a snap. Oh, I could do. Got it. Oh, I didn't even know I could Signal's coming from that structure over here. Oh, well. He's just on the fucking Let's go! Ooh, an alien. I'm picking up initiative tech nearby from above us. I see it. Up on that piece with the scaffolding. Oh, gross. It's working, but I'm just getting random symbols. Glyphs. With more glyphs to expand my database from Habitat 7, I could interface fully with the console. And hopefully start up whatever helps the atmosphere. I could provide analysis via the scanner, Pathfinder. Oh. Alright, so we gotta follow. Oh, it's up there. No problem. I'll find it. Right. It's slippery, but there's a great view! Could be crazy enough to carry heavy equipment up there. 
Too sophisticated for a salvager. Who else is studying this place? I think that's enough. Alright. Dude, that was legit break the fucking ankles. Building connection. I apologize for any discomfort. The system seems unstable. This what happened when my dad tried doing this? Your father interfaced directly with the atmosphere processor. That proved extremely hazardous. These structures could reveal its control center. System remains unstable. Doubling our power input might accelerate the process. I'll give it a shot. Wait! Hey, yo! Back oh. off, or I will put you down! Whoa! Easy. You've come this far. Just let it ride. Insider? I've been studying this tech for months. I don't know how you activated those glyphs, but you have to let them cycle through their channels. It's going to be all right. Trust me, okay? I know, I know. Who am I? I mean, it's obvious who you are. I saw the ship swoop in. You're a pathfinder. I was beginning to think the initiative just made you the guys up you so know? the rest of us wouldn't lose hope, but you're for real, huh? Not you. Are you for real? You were going to tell me who you are. I might just be the solution to all your problems. Well, look at that. System has stabilized. I'm establishing a connection. Oh, crap. I know these things from Habitat 7! Later! Just take them out! Throw off. targeting that one! They make little bots! Oh yeah, I have an ability to Not bad. My first tangle with the remnant was a lot messier. The remnant? These monoliths, the observer and assembler bots, they're all the remnants of something much bigger. But that's too long. Ugh, I hate long. So, the remnant. Like, my name's better as PP. PP? Her name is PP? You're a mystery. I've been really? Seeing those glyphs for months. Come on. You arrive and Come on, Bioware. <laughs> Her name is Pee Pee, guys. We're hoping it could do the same for Eos. Huh. Atmosphere manipulation? Maybe. Fits the model. All remnant tech is connected. You interfaced with this monolith somehow, and now it's pinging the others. If you wake them up too, they must lead to whatever master switch might fix the radiation. Interface with the monoliths, follow the connection to the source. Easy enough. Sure. Just don't piss off too many observers. Here, take my nav points. I'll be... I've got to figure this interfacing out. Just be careful. This planet's all kinds of strange. No, her name is PB, not PP. I kind of heard PB.
But all right, guys, I think to be a good spot to end the stream. We've been streaming for four hours, but I am gonna stream again later tonight. Maybe around like nine. I I say around like nine. So like in so set so six. No, I guess I'll stream at eight. Never mind. I just realized it's six. <laughs> I'll stream at eight, eight or eight thirty tonight. But yeah, I'm I'm gonna take a little break, eat some food, you know, just regenerate. Um, this is the first live stream, so you guys want to see. I hope you guys enjoy enjoying uh, Mass Effect Trauma because right now it's like all right because like there was a lot of boring shit, but obviously, obviously, it's telling us like what what's happening and shit, so we could get like a good idea of what the fuck. <laughs> So, um, I think we kind of passed the boring part now, so now we can actually fight in the game. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoy the stream. I will stream uh, later tonight. We'll be streaming, uh, obviously I said that 50 times, but like we'll be streaming Halo 3 tonight. So it's gonna be a lot of fun. Um, I think, I believe we're almost done with Halo 3. I think that we're already like at the arc. So, the mission of the arc. <laughs> what's good, wee boy? What's up, Boris? How's it going, my friend? How is it going? Oh, Boris, I haven't seen your ass in a while. Oh, fuck. Nah, you know what? Fuck it. It's making it like five hours today for this game, and then we can stream again. Oh, what's up, Boris? How's it going? Oh, no! I'm radiated! Oh! Wait, I'm chilling, uh, Boris. How are you doing? What the fuck did I just do? Yeah, did I just unmark my game? <laughs> How the fuck did I unmark my own quest? How the fuck did that happen? Imagine leaving all the craziness on the Nexus to be the first settlers here. So much riding on you, and then... This time will be different. Right. This is our element. That beep. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Alright. Get back in the vehicle. Oh, we gotta go around. I always said, we, not, we don't have to go through the water, do we? It's like, nope. Approaching site two. Brazilians. Didn't even finish unpacking. Ket were on them from the start. Can I mine these things? Yeah. 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 All right. Mind this. <laughs> Looks like a war zone. According to survivors, the get attacked from all sides. It was a massacre. Nexus not send a retrieval team for the bodies. We knew some were lost, Ryder. We weren't told they were left. Wonder how many are out there. Too many. Lexi, update Nexus records on Yalar Thysa. And get a recovery shuttle out here. Good idea. If she's got family, they deserve clo- Maybe we can push the cat back. With what army? Can you even find the safety on your pistol? I'm just going through the options. Evacuate or die. Those are the options. Initiative's not military. They weren't prepared. Maybe we can push the cat back. With what army? Can you even find the safety on your pistol? I'm just going through the options. Evacuate or die. Those are the options. Initiative's not military. They weren't prepared. 
birthday. We'll have a worse fucking birthday, though. <laughs> Everyone's dead. Maybe we can push the cat back. With what army? Can you even find the safety on your pistol? Wait, they're talking about the Geth? Or they're talking about initiatives not military they weren't all right all right Cora we got it you said that line like three times um, fuck is someone good oh they want oh that one dude. oh you'd think there'd be more bodies not that I'm complaining. Not a lot left behind for a massacre. What if they were removed? We know the Nexus didn't bother picking up the bodies. You don't think it could have been the cat? Are you trying to give me nightmares? I go through this. He died protecting this outpost, and we left him. We'll make it right, Liam. Lexi, update records for Trinidus Gordanus. Consider it done, Pathfinder. Portable cover of cat design. Didn't bother to take it with him. They're like, eh, fuck it. Let's go, we need it. They're like, no, we don't. Override works, but... Sam, the door was sealed from the outside? Yes, Pathfinder. It appears lockdown was manual before the power restrictions. Why do that? It wouldn't keep anything out. It would keep something in. Hey, was there something in there? Again, I continue. I will. Way too quiet. Where's this quiet? It's after a mask. And more done than mask. A maintenance bulletin was issued at the time of shutdown. What does it say? Run. Override, close it! Tempest, we have an unknown enemy. Evac the Pathfinder. Whoa, hold on. No go, Harper. We have to lay low. Ket are inbound to your location. Ket and that thing? Son of a... Bitch. He doesn't say it, and I will. Then I will! Secondary terminals. No access. Sam, if deployment is standard, main access will be deep in. Hey, let me see if we can. Huh? Oh, you big. Yeah, you can go flying, motherfucker. Oh, shit, I'm in a radiation zone. Reload! Holy shit, that thing is huge! I'm even juggling that thing from Mass Effect 3. Another dropship with reinforcements. Watch out! Oh, that's how you Fuck you, bitch. If I knew that earlier, I would have
Be sure. Look sharp. That thing is out there. And the cat? Everything's grounded till they're gone. Heck, of course. Why is he running and shooting at the same time? That is a snap. Big boy. All right, so we gotta go in this. Room. Not sure what's worse, this or dying slow, like promise. Happy thoughts, Liam. <laughs> Happy thoughts. This component was security tagged for site two. Looks like they had some sort of special project going. Let's find the rest. Surprised the Nexus still wants an outpost on EOS. You know what they say. Third time's a charm. Schematics for Special Project Sigma. They were building Sigma? something, but there are parts missing. This must be the project they were salvaging at Site 1. A way to fight the cat. We could finish it. All components at Site 2 had security tags, compiling possible nav points. Lifestyle. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna end the stream here, boys. Though, but we will stream again later tonight, and uh, we'll play some Halo Three tonight, boys. So yeah, I'll see you guys then. If you guys want to see more Ma Mass Effect Atromina, make sure you hit that like button, and and uh, you know, or you want to see other content that I make, I stream, you know, I stream Halo Three. I mean, stream in, um, we started Mass Effect Atromina. We gotta do uh, most of the other. I don't know. But, like, anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoy. I will see you guys later tonight. If not, I'm going to be streaming around, like, 8.30. But if not, then I will see you guys tomorrow. Anyway, guys, take care. I love